Jo, gluk! Patreon Abuser. Jo. Jo, for eks, det er et søjvarkab. Welcome bros, welcome Stormcrow, Joforex, Tatsoi, Yopa both Firebird, but Shrubs, Micah, there's Dark Blitz with the fat, bro with knife, looking vascular today, Alois, thank you, appreciate it. My pizza man, how are you? Suck my nuts. Uh, welcome to you, to Alois underscore Netherlands, thank you so much. Yo, welcome Skate, welcome Sark Turner. Patreon abuser, we're gonna have a new video idea. I'll do set this month. I'll have a set video this month. Hex, look, suck my nuts. Yo, Johnny plays live. Good to see you. Yo, microwaving tea. Yo, eat in moderation. I'm doing amazing, bro. Good to see you. Today we talk to the most and now with the pick slender. Alois is a big man from the Netherlands. Yo, Stormcraft, they're gonna prime. They're gonna 14, bro. It's gone amazing. Thank you for asking. No, I'm not gonna go fleet. I think the. These two trees are too good to avoid. What the hell is their draft chat? Is that Teemo support? Briar top? I think it's Briar top. Flushing Knight is mandatory. Um, and I, should, I think I should go bone plating, right? But I don't know who's actually top. I'm gonna go for this. I'm gonna go Flushing Knight. Let's go. This seems solid. I got a Twitch again, I like Shen Twitch, because if you go stealth and I ult, it's like, in stealth. You should go Hail Blade Sand, shit goes hard. No, I think it's Vladimir Mid, Teemo support, Small Trade Carry, Briar Top, Lee Sin Jungle, that's my guess. He also banned Garen, that's my guess. No Genius Hunter, no, we're gonna go Ultimate Hunter, that's what Petu said. Ultimate Hunter is simply too good. We're also going Titanic Hydra Sterex build. I'm not gonna go like Eclipse or items like this, so yeah. Yes, we tried Eclipse yesterday, but the build that uh, Petu recommended, which is like the most consistent all around the build, is Titanic Hydra. Okay, yeah, we were right. Let's go Lethal Challenger. Um, the recommended build is Titanic Hydra Sterex and then Situational to the Draft. Can Shen hard carry games? No, you are, by definition, as a Shen, a facilitator. Can you hard carry games? Yes, but that would be that you are peeling your teammates well enough so that they can carry, in the general sense. You are not a 1v9 champion. You're not gonna win the game by split pushing, you're not gonna win the game by having highest resources. You are not, by definition, a 1v9 champion. He's playing Ignite TP, so he is very gankable. Well, I hope my jungler knows that. Yo, welcome everybody. Yo, Roblox Tiny. The games were pretty rough. We end up with five wins, four losses, so pretty hard. Yo, they forgotten. Game looks like a win already? My man. I'm gonna drag my blade here and just like have it in the center here. Why not? Solid. Aggressive setup. Yo, they forgotten. Actually, maybe it wasn't the best because I want to look for a ward if I get the chance to. Well, the range is very long. Okay, it moved a bit now. I get my ward here, just so I know where jungles are starting. Looks like Viego's pathing to both, so I'm gonna be weak sided. Say so Patat or Frit? Heike, I say both. But, I probably say Patat more often. I kinda use them interchangeably, I don't really care. Used to be a big thing, but I actually don't care anymore. Blade could be deeper. But here's where the wave is going to be at. I think this is more than fine. Like, the wave neutralizes here, right? Viego's already... Sorry, bro. We'll just, just say sorry. Say sorry, and it's, it's good to start laying for me. Never leash, never leash. Okay, I'm gonna look for priority. She has a deep blade. I wanna drag my blood through her. What the hell? Okay. That attack speed is so nasty. Very good trades here. 
I mean, she doesn't really have any trade potential when she wants that ability, right? Remember, she has no flash here. I'm gonna get my level 2. Okay, I mean, very good early game here. Briar has no health sustain. Look, she stays at 316 HP. The only champion in the game that has zero health sustain, besides hitting me is like with her W, she, 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 she stays on 316 HP. She has no uh, health regen. And no flash. And no HP left. And this guy's a pig. And that's why you don't play Briar top. Because you have no health regen. And that makes your champion a super bad laner. Well, third wave crash, get a kill, um, amazing start here, I'll just get my recon. I slay you, thank you for the prime, Robert Mackers, thank you for the prime as well. Uh, Clarity, send me the song, bro. Okay, I'm gonna go for, uh, this, there we go. Uh, actually, wait, the Petu did say that we could go... Bami Cinder in matches where we're gonna be trading a lot. Maybe we should go Bami Cinder Rush, actually. Oh, let's see. Um, thank you for the primers, guys. And um, what is your song? What is this song? I'm gonna try it. Okay. Okay. It's an angry song. We lost a little bit of extra HP by not getting the preferred reset in, but it's okay. Ah, uh, we just get three Q stacks. All good. Briar's probably gonna reset because she has no items, so she wants to reset get some extra items for herself. That's all good. She's gonna lose some extra XP for that. I'm gonna Q so I get extra on hit damage, right? Gonna last it at latest frame so I can get my Q again here. So now I get my Q again and I get the extra on hit. Don't lose any lasses. Lovely. We're in a good position. Slow pushing to him again. Both jungles are here. You see Lee Sin has a blue buff. And that's lasting longer than her rep right? This rep has expired and Lee Sin has a blue buff. That means he started rep buff. So even though Lee Sin is bot side right now, he did start rep buff. So after this death, Lee Sin is gonna go into bot lane again because that is where our scams are gonna be up right now. And I know that because I clicked on my on enemy jungler to see what buffs he has. And of course, if his blue buff is still running and his rep buff has expired, that means logically that he's not rep buff. I missed my Q and my E. That's impressive. And my W is so broken against her. Now I just gotta dodge this. She has no flash. Q blacked it through her. Uh, hit a medium for fun. Get level 5. Drag my blade through her if I can. And not even a close fight, baby. Let's go. Level 5 timer. Listen is bot side. I know that because I'm tracking the jungler. If he's somehow top side, he's, uh, he's a genius. And uh, I'll give him the kill for fun. Simply because he would deserve it. But he should always be bot side. So I'm not really scared of the jungler right now. Because I'm tracking the junglers. Because I have fundamentals. So here I use my level up timer to level 5. Right? To start the fight with the Briar. On top of the fact that I'm not scared of Lee Sin. Because I know his pathing. Because I'm consciously thinking about Lee Sin pathing. So I know how to play my own waves. If I knew Lee Sin would go on top side there. I would never fight him. Because jungle tracking. GG. Any general trackers in the chat? I'm gonna try this. Is there any general trackers in my chat right now? Incoming int. Hey, it's Bamban. Suck my nuts. Man really getting high of fundamentals. Who wouldn't? Who wouldn't? In his right mind. No. Alright. Noops. Noops. Kidding. Alright, I still got my Flesh Ignite. This guy has uh, no Ignite, so I have that advantage. Lee Sin should be around here, here right now. And so I gotta be a little bit careful on this bounce, because Lee Sin is here. I don't want to look to ult somebody right now, because if I do... I'm gonna lose a Fat Wave, and I don't want to lose a Fat Wave, because more Fat IRL. Drag my blood through her. Ignite for the stop the healing. E through her dash. Hit them here for fun. Solo Paulo. We got ultimate right now. Now I'm fine to ult onto somebody because this wave is pushing towards me anyways. I won't lose much. So I'm going to keep this wave pushing towards me. There's a plant on river that I can look for because it spawns at 6 minutes in the game. And I have a plan to handle that you guys should be applying. Oh, look at that. Check his items. Double longsword. He's not strong enough for me. Ah! Beta, mind control, mind control. Okay, so fundamentals and mechanics do not... See, that that's the difference between fundamentals and mechanics. I am not mechanically gifted on my champion. I have fundamentals, though. So, just don't look at what happened there, and we move on. Okay? We're still good. We're 3-0. Let's go, baby. 
She's level 6 now? Level 7? Why are you still pushing it to me? Want to drag my blood through her if I can? QW to block the minions. Hold the wave if you're a little bit outside of turret range to force it to walk with full assets. Okay, that was. Oh! She got a turret shot because of that. Yo, thank you for the 100, bro. Mon Von White. Did you guys see that? She dashed, she pushed me away, but I taunted her so she walked forward into the turret range. Thank you, uh, Clarity. You got another song? I'm gonna use all my channel points. Okay. Go for the last hit, bro. She is not close to level 7, as far as I'm concerned. Choose both her potions. My biggest priority here would be to try and push out the wave, though. YouTube out to play put me to Brandon Savage, I think. I'm gonna slow push this wave, hard push next. I do X. Oh, there's the Lee Sin. He's level 6. That's what I instantly checked. Still the same items to earlier, so Lee Sin actually didn't recall last time we fought him. Calls dog in all chat. Mind controlling. Remember, this guy's no sustain. Thank you for the T1. No, Darius video is not out. I'm sorry. The Yorick video will be first. I still need to play a few more lower ELO games on Darius because it started in Emerald. But I will I will get the Darius content out and I will make an extra Darius video. So stay tuned for the Darius content. I'm sorry for that. Alright. Thank you so much for the uh for the sub boss. Alright, I appreciate this way get my reset in. Alright, uh, I'm gonna skip this song. Go here. Nice. I'm so tanky actually with these items. Vladimir's on rank edition. I have ult here and need to. No. Oh, Clarity did another song. What song do you have? Oh, now this is starting good. Mad? Mad. I think it's assist! I am mad. No ultimate hunter stack. Sorry, chat. Sorry for screaming. Let's focus. I thought I get assist. It's because I switched the song, so I blame. Listen, still in reset. I don't like the vocals too much. This guy sounds like a pirate. Alright, let's keep the focus. Listen, is here. Still hasn't recalled. You know, when I missed my flash on Listen, which is four minutes ago, he still hasn't recalled since. I keep pressing tab. Every time I see my opponent on the or enemy jungle on the map, I keep pressing tab, right? Look at that, he still hasn't recalled. Keep tracking that because then you know what fights you should be taking or what Ooh. Well, at least in died because he hadn't reset, piggy. I'm putting her in lethal range soon. Everyone wants cannon minions. Everybody wants cannons, guys. Everybody wants cannons. Always use them as bait. Alright, get the shit out. Two plates, three phones. No, next wave. One plate, next wave. We got Hydra. We have perma wave clear. We can keep controlling the map. 125 gold from that. Around 100 gold from the wave. I can always sell my refill, which is actually what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna get these melees. There we go. And I'll sell my refill. Alos, do you think smurfing accounts was playing a lower rank room game experience on new players and also inflate ELO? Yes, there's definitely that, yes. And I'm well aware that I do that. Um, okay. We have item. We don't need to be full HP. And let's keep snowballing. Let's see the full Eclipse in base. Song is decent. Song is decent. This part is really good. Alright. We have ult in 40. I want more ultimate hunter stacks because all four are on this. I, I thought I'd get it on Vladimir, but sadly I, I haven't. Uh, we have a 40 shutdowns. We get our flashback. We can perma wave clear now, so that's going to make it easier to find ultimate angles too. Simply because right now I don't have to worry that if I... Like, I can push the wave first and then ult, so I don't lose resources. And she doesn't get plates. 
I just did like 300 damage to her there with Titanic procs. I have ult. Yeah, they can push. Okay. Uh oh. Wait, I wasn't paying attention anymore. Not my fault though. Oh my days, they all died. That's not good. I don't know if I could have been ready for that. We have six grubs as well. Okay. Good song. We're moving back to here. Okay. Let's focus here. Oh. I clicked! I gotta, I gotta have higher focus. I'm not gonna alt-tap anymore because I feel like I've lost many windows now. Just like, tapping, switching to music and stuff like this. We should dive here. Level 11, so that's gonna lower my ultimate cooldown by default. If we sing counter ganks, I have ult. Okay, don't have to ult. Okay, I have Perma Prior. I think I'm just gonna buy CDR boots, by the way. How much coffee do you drink per day? One or two cups, usually. Or like, you call it cups? Yeah, I think cups is the good word, right? One or two cups. I try to stay away from drinking too much. Yes, I know you can press R here as well. Okay, I need to look for an ult. Because, like, look, there's two level gap here in AD which is very bad. And uh, I am super strong, but you don't really want gold to be on the Shen, right? You kind of want gold to be on the Twitch or the Fist's game. The other carry is not me. I want to get more ultimate hunter stacks. Unfortunately, I missed the one on Vladimir earlier. But if I can get them on their bot lane or something like this, like a skirmish, I have R. This Lee Sin is going for collector, it looks like, so... Okay, that's good. That's really massive. They get a kill there. This guy hasn't recalled for a very long time. There we go. This is a good one. Oh. You should die. There we go. We get a shutdown on the Twitch. We get his flash. So 1940 jungle. And I get my ultimate hunter stack. Super worth. Exactly what we're looking for. And now we're gonna go for Sterox. I can't find the long sword. There we go. Okay. Twitch or Fizz, you should just back off. We got a second ultimate hunter stack. Two minute cooldown on our ultimate now, that's pretty decent. And like I said, like, Briar getting gold back in this game or getting some resource or waves in doesn't matter that much. If, let's say, Briar gets 200, 300 gold, but I secure the Twitch 500 gold, that's worth it for me, right? Because he's my win condition. Briar might think she can recall. I'm gonna find her, though. There is no dispute. Where are you? Are you here? No. Okay, so my Viego and Twitch are somewhat in a good position. My Fizz is really far behind this game. Not much I can do about that. I think I can beat Vladimir Silent though. Okay, she has Eclipse now, so she might feel like she can beat me, but she has no idea how strong I am. I want her to like W on the wave. Yeah, there's a ward. She moved towards me. I have ult in one minute, I'm gonna keep communicating that. Okay, Teemo and Lee Sin are top. I see the icon of two champions, right? So time to back off. They kill Smolder for the second time now. That's amazing news. I never want to trade the 1v1 because I have 800 shutdown, right? So it's never good for me to look for a 1v1 type of trade simply because the guy's already out, out of the game in a way anyways. Yo, Sparky. Yo, MM Stardust. I mean, we're gonna... I only played one game after the Petu coaching, so we're gonna see today how to do. But the first game here is good, right? Good early game here. Haven't been able to transition my lead too much across the map, but we're doing our best. But I feel like I've been kind of training waves too much, so now I'm just gonna move to this dragon. See if we can play for this with the bros. I have ult as well. Listen, there's no flash. We have that timer. Ah. Uh, I have ult. I think I can just stay here. She died. I win this too, if I drag my blade through him. 
Look at that damage. Two people top. Oh, yeah, I'm griefing. That's really bad. Uh, I lose my flesh and I give a fat shot to Smolder because I'm a pig. And we already knew that, but that sucks! Sorry. MB. MB. MB chat. MB, 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 MB. We go for this. Listen, there's no flesh. Lean off. Yo, Faker underscore NL. Yo! As a Riven main, why the hell I found Yorick so fun now? I feel it has more carry potential to 1v9 yes. in low elo than with Riven. It does. GL on the grind with Thank you so much, man. Thank you for the three. Thank you, King Top, for your generosity always. Oh, I am at the old angle here. Thank you always for your generosity. Give it to Viego. Or Fizz. I don't need kills. I need to start getting more kills to my teammates. But my Fizz or my Twitch is strong now. That's good. I gave Smolder a shutdown on me though. A very big shutdown. And because I died, she all he also got the top lane turret. So there, dying isn't just like 300 gold. I oh Smolder's here. Don't go. I died, giving him the shutdown. He got a wave. I lost the wave because I died. And he got a turret. So I, I switched like Unironically, 2k gold to this guy, probably for dying there, right? So, that one death I did to the smaller there, even though it might seem... Like, it, it's bad, right? But understanding how bad it is is so important. Like, that death was beyond terrible. It was... It's, it's like a blunder blunder. It's like sacrificing your queen, but not getting anything for it. Does that make sense? Well, that guy's a pig. Look, he, she got full item now, and that's because I died. Uh, yeah, that, that Teemo, like, we just don't talk about that. I just want to, I don't know where his Q was. I don't think my W blocks Q, so I don't know. They just died. We get a turret down too. Uh, there's a Briar though. I'm gonna pick my Viego to hover. Gonna give it to Viego. Gonna give kills always. I don't have ult, but nice. We win. We push out this wave. We're very close to Sterox. 1500, we'll have it. First game is going good now. Besides the one death we had, I'm pretty happy with my gameplay. And I'm gonna light it to the smolder here. Let's go. Oh, that's bad though. Yeah, he's dead. That's a fat shot to the to Vladimir. Okay, that's a good flash timer though. Remember, chat, if your opponents don't have inspiration, they can't have lower cooldown on their uh, flash with... Um, with the, the runes, but you see here, no inspiration, but he does have a CDR boost, right? So five minutes here, 1944, so I would say it's 24, uh, 44, right? But he also has CDR also, boost, so you just subtract like 40 like seconds, so now it's like you can make 24 flat IRL, this F, is not accepted anymore. Kidding mods, I love my wife. Also, oh, also the fact that like the most of your is because you can make your wife getting hit while... Thank you for the three. Thank you for the three. All right, let's focus. We can look for the five v five scenario, and we're in a good position. I have ult. Um, I'm not sure if he survives that. I should have pressed W. I'm gonna ignite that guy. Stop the healing. Holy shit. Okay. Please sit his top. Why am I getting spam pinged? This seems flashed. I'm gonna play it for a soul in a minute. Yes, Frappy, I will consider an unrated master with a Mundo. But. Uh, since we're doing a tank here, I'm not sure when I do a tank again. Um, oh, there's that. We almost have 10 cents per minute on Shen, by the way. I'm gonna push this wave out, recon, and then move to my team for a dragon. I have 3 out of 5 stacks now. I still need Vladimir, I believe, and Smolder. And then I have all my ultimate hunter stacks. Uh, I think I should just finish this. Or should I finish this? No, I'll get this. And then I'll get some magic resist now for the Vladimir. But Petu recommended me to go for movement speed items. So, um... Oh. Let me focus here. Twitch ulting for that seems a little strange. 
So we should prioritize this magic resist item. This one right here. This guy's a flesh. It's half its HP right there. Remember, I'm a tank, right? So that's good. We can play for this dragon, but Viego is in base. I don't want Briar to get this tier 2 top though. Or was it smaller that was here? Or good though. We had a small coaching session with uh, Petu. We should do this dragon ASAP, yeah? Just, we're gonna do a bigger coaching session with uh, Petu like in the next few days. I'm gonna push out bot now because I have ult. You can fight, I have R. Listen, has no flash and mid no flash either. Oh. Blabber's level 14, two items, two items. Briar's correct play would have been to keep pushing top, but since he didn't, I'm allowed to go bot. If Briar had kept pushing, I should have recalled and gone top. <clears throat> I can't really split push by myself, but I can look to solo kill this guy very easily, because she, she's super weak. She's only one item, right? I have ult here. I'm gonna pay attention. Wait, there's two people here, by the way. Okay, well, I trade one for one. But two, like, we died mid. Listen is here, and two people are bot, and somehow we were losing mid. This is kind of weird. It's not kind of weird, that's just terribly. Terrible weird. All right, though, it happens. Uh, I didn't expect him to send two bots. Let's go 5v5 and do an Ash. I think I just group with my team now. They have no Lucian Flash. Their bot has no Flash, especially if we get the skill, which we shoot. Nice. Now we play for Ash. Wait for... I'm coming to... Um, does Red have ult? He does. Okay, we want to force Nash now. Redeem the song while you were dead? Okay, let me go there. Yes, we'll have a coaching session with Petu. Okay. Sabaton can be good. I need my team to just listen to my call here. They should have started already. Uh, well, we're spotted now. Never mind. I guess get out. No, I'm not sure about this call, by the way. Okay, we do kill with Twitch. Okay, that's good. Okay, nice. Nice. Uh, I push side lane because I went silent against this guy, and then I can always ult in. So we're still in a good position. Nice. Two people mid, two people dead, only Briar's unknown. No one home. I'll just hit the turret. I don't have to ult. I might need anti-heal against this guy now actually, to keep winning. Without anti-heal I won't win. Kidding. Static shield, baby. Had to warn me for that. Nobody expects the static shield. It's too massive. Oh, let's recall. Again, my team died when I'm 2v1-ing. I never really understand that part. Nah, I shouldn't 1v1. I shouldn't ego. Let's not ego play here. I think I should buy a sit, sit just on this though. Because remember, Bramble chat gets proc if somebody hits you, right? But Briar's always gonna hit me. Vladimir's a little bit harder. If Vladimir doesn't auto attack me, I actually cannot proc the Bramble fest on him. But a lot of people will still auto attack me just because they're like silly. Boys, we can play for the tier two now. 
Actually, my Twitch should recall and go bolt and go here. I have ult. I have ult. Do I want to ult this guy? No. I get a tier 2 here. I lose so much HP from just farming the wife. True, actually, if I have Vlad with E, he'll auto attack me by default. Can we get a tier 2? 800 gold? My Bobby Cinder is giving me turret aggro. I got six auto attacks there with procced Q. I I had three. I had, like draw my blade through him, and then Miles fight I draw again through him. I can one v one this. I think even though he's almost four items because I have Steric shoot. I want to limit test here because I think the game is won anyway. So I want to limit test. Look at Steric shoot. FF. FF. My Steric shoot procced at a timer. I didn't want it. Okay, chat. And do not do not say a word. Okay. It proked when he didn't combo, so it was like shit. I taunted him and then my Sterex proked. So the shit did nothing. So. Okay, that's fine. Let's not limit us. Let's end this game close. Sorry, mate. I'm not this noob. Sorry, mate. I am not this noob. I can type. Oh, imagine I could ult. Imagine I could ult here. Oh shit, and we lose all sums. We can lose. Uh, I should never limit test. My bad. NTU is really good though against all their champions. No, we didn't. Dwarange Blade Untersheet him. Oh. Mad. I still only have three ultimate hunter stacks, but 110 seconds is not bad. I only have 25 ability haste as well. I don't even have that much haste. Anti heal. This guy's weak. Wait, she's my TP. She might TP. <laughs> I had a feeling, Chad. Piggy. Piggy. Alright, let's go. Let's keep pushing. We have ult in a minute. Let's hold those four items. Well, I landed my E, so I get the kill. No piggy. I have ignite. Static shoot. At the right time now. And he dies to death stance. Hold on. See! See! My champion is strong. My champion can move one piggy inside lane. This build feels good too. I like the Stadax. I like it a lot. Stadax is definitely cooking. Okay, FF. And the and the and the anti is actually really good. Anti is good here. I didn't need to land the taunt to get my kill. I just need the auto attack. True. Okay, we start off the day solid with a 15 kill game, which is very high for a champion like Shen, of course. All right, GG. Good start, good start. Alright, Clarity, what other game do you have? Clarity, how many points do you have, bro? What? How many songs are you, are you, are you, are you, are you like, uh, shooting out here? Like, dish, dish, dish. Finally, he bought anti heal and he wins. Imagine if he listened earlier. Yeah, imagine if your mom raised the... Okay. 
Uh, we give the honor to Nyx Masters. He did good. Hello, Alois and L. I am currently an Emerald 2 player on E West. In counter matchup, I noticed the enemy top laner crushes third wave and has massive kill pressure on me when the wave bounces back. How do I avoid this? They should not have massive kill pressure on you when the wave bounces back when they do a third wave crash, unless you have lost too much HP before the crash. So how do you circumvent that? First of all, don't lose a lot of HP whilst they're pushing you in. Because if you're full HP and the wave bounces, if he does a third wave crash, you're gonna hit level 4 first on the bounce and actually you're stronger then. You're gonna have a bigger wave because you're bouncing the wave towards him, so you're gonna have a bigger wave. And you hit your level timers fast at level 4, level 5, so you should actually be stronger. Yes, we are gonna get coached by Petu soon. Not sure when? Soon. Uh, there's so many songs open now. Right, there we go. All right, uh, what's some uh, chill video to watch? Is there a synapse? Tyler1 called everyone out. Mm, no, let's not watch that. Does your W only block hits on you or teammates as well? I mean, it blocks hits on teammates as well. That's why you can peel. It's like a safe zone for everybody. It's like uh, you, if you... The, the Shen W is the no-no square circle. Hi, Alois, and now greetings from Brazil. I really love Orn. I think you should try him. He has such a carry potential. Bro, Orn is a tank. How are you going to carry with a tank? It's like... It's like... Con your, your message has internal contradiction. Can we finish the Skyblock video? I finished it. Adam got Dante's account banned? Wait, what, what does Adam have to do with it? How does Adam get Dante's account banned then? How is it... How is that on Adam? How does that work? So we have a TLDR? Any TLDRs? There's no way, right? Mm -mm 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 -mm. My sh Alright, you know what, I'll first pick. Why not? Uh, mm, 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 mm. Alright, I'm gonna watch a video that I saw earlier. Uh, there was this video I saw my recommended. How Professor uh, Akali lost his reputation. I was like, what is this? Yo, Geo, dude. Thank you for the Prime. Yeah, welcome, bro. Yo, Wazek. Alright, this is a video I was interested in watching, actually. What is this? We play more the Kaiser. That's not a good matchup. I know that much. It's not a good matchup, but we're gonna we're gonna figure it all out. I might go QS. What if we go Doran's Klingen Untersheet? But I, I I'm actually curious to watch this. No, I haven't done more to my... What is that draft again, chat? I am so confused. Is it Senna Cassante bot? Is it Senna Aurelia bot? I'm assuming it's Brand Jungle. And then I'm lost. But this guy banned Gwen. So I assume it's more Kaiser top. And Cassante mid. And Aurelia Senna bot. That's my guess. Mm... Yeah, that's it. Pretty much. <clears throat> Your 10 0 Mordekaiser with no items. Oh, if you are 10 0, more than with no items kills you with Aurea. That's why you need, um, what's its name? QSS. All right, let's watch this video. I'm I'm very curious to see this. Wait, what was this, what was this title?
it's always interesting for like i find this video interesting to watch just for my own understanding and knowledge too because i feel like i'm in a super privileged position and i would like to learn from other people's mistakes You, you know what, what's one thing that is always super interesting about this position, right? Is I am well aware that I'm also playing in lower MMRs, but I can, I can give you 10, well not 10, but like so, a lot of good reasons as to why I don't want to stream high elo gameplay right now. And of course, I'm not playing high elo to show like, look, I can 1v5 against bronze players. My ultimate goal playing in lower MMR is to teach people, right? And to educate people. So I feel like I have a good balance with it. Although I understand the side that I ruin games for people. But at the end of the day, what is your job as a content creator? It is to entertain people. For me, it's also educating people, and you, as a content creator, you should look to make videos that grant you the most views, right? So even though he was doing quote-unquote cringe content, if it was performing the best for him, I can understand why he did that, though. Like, I don't, you cannot really blame him for going down a path of content that is genuinely generating him more views, because at the end of the day, as a content creator, your ultimate goal is to grow and to get views, right? So it's it's kind of really weird for me to like see this. So I understand that people dislike clickbait and and like uh, this type of content, but at the other, it, 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 you know, there is a there is so many people that do this. Yo, Niles. Yeah, but I'm playing a lot of MMR, bro. We're doing an unranked mass. It's good to see you, Niles, man. Um, hope you're doing amazing and uh, well for yourself. Thank you. Oh, no, never mind. That was an older Prime. But yeah, I find this a hard... This is like an interesting topic, right? Because, I don't know, you can compare this to so many things. But you can be angry at Professor Akali for doing clickbait content and to have um, his content surrounding this. But at the end of the day, his job as a content creator is to entertain people. And if this brings in the highest amount of views, why would he not do it? Doing low and work content is fine. Doing clickbait is unethical. <clears throat> okay, I can see that. I'm not saying that I, like, my goal by watching this video is also to um, educate myself on other people's mistakes so I don't make them myself, right? That, that would be my idea with watching this content. But it is very interesting how he's being shunned for having clickbait titles when, truthfully, so many people do that. Even I will occasionally, like, the thing is, when I'm trying to think of a title for a video, it's like I want a title to be accurate with what I'm doing, but at the end of the day, you also want it so people click on it, right? So, you, like, w when I did, like, uh, like, playing Yorick, you're gonna be like, oh, Yorick can do Nash at minute 20, which is something I actually didn't know, unironically, but then, uh, that, that is kind of can be conceived as clickbait, right? So, it, there's kind of some fine lines there for sure. Uh, but yeah, like playing 1v5 against bronze players and like, you know, getting your your stuff out of that. I can see the uh, the downside to that and why it's why it's perceived as negative. But I feel like there's a... I don't know. It, it's kind of weird. Alright. Uh, what playlist do we go for? I'll just go for this one and chill. Um, now let's start back on this game. Enough yapping about content creation and stuff like this. We're playing against a Conqueror Garen with TP, which is weird. Um... So that gives me the notion that this guy is mainly looking to scale. Uh, I should win the early trades very hard because he cannot out damage my Q trades, right? With the passive shoot and then also three apart auto attack, especially if I drag my blade through him. They have a volleyball jungle. So 2v2, I think, is you know pretty even depending on who gets um, the right forms. I can W his Q, I can W his Q, right? So there's a lot of things that, like, my W is very important in the 2v2s. Oh, the music is way too loud. I'm sorry, chat. Sorry, 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 sorry. Yeah, no, it's because I, I upped the Google Chrome audio for the YouTube video, but now the music is so loud. I'm sorry, my bad. All right, let's focus here. Uh, my jungle is batting to top. Now, Belvet could look for like a level 3 mid, level 3 bot, but she's probably going to do rep off into golems and then patting to top, right? So, 
I know that, and I don't see Garen here, so I assume he leashed. He lost some HP as well. And I want to drag my bed through him for the most beneficial trades here. Yeah, one hit with the grass, but it's good. He's stuck by him. My Q is coming back up. Good trade here. Equal health trade benefits me because I'm playing with Flesh Ignite. I think I can kill him here. They're underestimating my damage. Very common. I don't think I kill him here. Even with the Q range, I don't think I kill him. But here you see, right, so many people will underestimate Shen's early game damage. Shen is stronger than, I would say, 80% of early game top lane champions. Like, he outstead checks the Reddington, can even win against Shindemir, Darius, these type of champions. If he gets the conditions where you drag your blade through your opponent. And, like I said, this Garen probably doesn't know that if I drag my blade through him, that I do additional damage and get higher attack speed because he wasn't trying to avoid it right and he wasn't anticipating higher damage he was like wait shen one shoots me uh now i'm slow pushing this wave to allow this next wave to walk through my lane and then i'll be looking to crash the wave i'm gonna do two points of q oh try to last it at the latest frame so this wave gets more room to walk up here i gotta memorize that this guy's playing with tp though so I'm just gonna crash the 4th wave and look for my own reset and then look to play against him on the bounce. 4th wave crash is way better than 3rd wave simply because we uh, stay the same level up, right? So here after I recall, Garen right now is kind of forced to make a bad decision because he's gonna have to collect this and hard push next wave if he wants to set up his own reset, but he could also just push this and reset. But then the wave is slow pushing towards me. So regardless of what happens here, if I'm fast enough back into lane, I should always be in a good position. So it looks like Garen wants to try and hard push this next wave, and that is why I try to recall and instantly run back. Yeah, Robert Mecker, I'm actually working on that. But the thing is, with making a list about early game top lane champions and their strength, is that it's super conditional and two things can be true at once. For example, if you lane against a Jax, you could lane against a Jax that has Grasp, D-Shoot, and um, TP, right? Or you could lane against a Jax that goes Lethal Tempo, D-Blade, Flash Ignite. So, same champion, completely different scenario. Or you could lane against a Shen that goes D-Shoot, Flash TP, or lane against a Shen that goes D-Blade, Flash Ignite, right? So, you gotta always memorize that starting item, runes, and summoners are, play the biggest role. He tp back, that's why he's back already. Honor. I just wanna look to small trade with him. I get my level 5 here. So the trade is very beneficial for me. I missed my blade pool though, threw him. So a little bit awkward trade. I should've eaten too cute. Um, if yeah. anybody flames my wallop, I'm permabanning you. Be strong, my friend. You can do it. Thank you so much for the tier one, boss man. I appreciate it. Yo, Juicer, I get to see you, brother. I'm slow pushing this wave to allow this wave to walk up. It's gonna be a little closer to his turret, but I think if I last latest frames, it will just walk ahead a little bit. I think I lost one melee worth of XP, so I might not hit my level six here from this wave. And I'll need one melee on next wave, and I'll get it exactly like that. No, I can't W his uh, E, of course. Actually, I think I lost no XP. I think I get my 6 here. Beautiful. I have ult, just in case something happens. My Belvedere hasn't reset yet. And Volubear, I mean, she have already reset the pathing back into bot again. I don't know what my Belvedere has been doing. She stayed on the map for a very long time. I Okay, there's Volubear and he has reset, right? So, that's what I'm checking there. Drag my blade through him. You see, this guy does not know that dragging my blood through him gives me extra damage. He is not aware. And this is a Platinum player, almost Emerald player. Now my combo that I want to do is E through him and then Q so that my blade goes through him again directly. Try to bait out this W maybe. He did not use W there. He's gonna go for this cannon though. Drag my blade through him. Ignite as well. And he will die. Goodbye baby. This wave is pushing into me so I'm gonna thin it out a little bit and then set up my own reset that way. And now what should happen is... My, my, the wave will push towards me, but not fast enough, and this next wave will take over the aggro, so it will stay frozen to my side. I'm gonna go for Bami Cinder for the HP, and uh, now we'll go for Titanic Hydra. What Petu explained me is in melee matchups where you're gonna be trading a lot, or have a lot of trade opportunities, you should go Bami Cinder to perma have grasp up, and yeah, you just get better trade patterns, so I'm gonna try that. I could ult here, but it's pretty bad because I'd lose a lot of waves, so... Uh, 
I feel like a real Shen player would TP here and probably get one or two kills. Me? If they overcommitted, I would have altered, but I, I'm, I wasn't sure if I could get something there. I block his Q. That one is looking. I'm trying to bait more. Oh, I might die. Wow, it's because of Conqueror as well. I'm a pig. They should leave this way. No, they should actually push it out. I'm such a pig for greeting that. I was also still in my head thinking about the previous play. They should push this and push this next wave. Push both. I'll move mid. Look at my potions. I have... I used my E though. That's really bad that I used my E, but... Okay, one stack. I don't have my E. I'm such a pig. I have boots though. I should catch up. Okay, I have three ultimate hunter stacks, so the play is still really good here. But I oh, I learned something new from that. Don't habitually use your E out of base because that will happen. I might have kill pressure on this guy. Well, now we have four ultimate hunter stacks. Uh, I love my life. You can go mid. Well, uh, I mean, I died to the Garen consciously. So that Talia would get extra waves in top lane. And so that I would ult bot without feeling mentally pressured to not do it. Because I would be catching a wave. And now I have four ultimate hunter stacks. So now it's only three minutes. Hopefully. Keep mirroring, chat. Keep mirroring. You guys, you guys, you guys wouldn't understand why I died to the Garen earlier. Did you? Bullshit! No. Go for the cannon, baby. I shouldn't look for extended fights, because this E just wins the extended fight against me. Obviously, because of Conqueror as well. So I'm gonna look for more short trades with him. Yo, Jadrian. Shen is... Different. I'm learning. I use my passive better too. Kind of wasting it. Tread carefully. Bad W. Thought it Q. Check my bed through him though. One, two, three. Ignite. Check my blood through him again and die! Almost die, almost die, almost die! If he flash Qs? Okay. And the Conqueror is tricky. I've lost too much HP and I'm also sitting on 1.5k gold, so I need to set up a reset. Okay, I can't kill him because of his W. And he sustains too much. My ult's coming back on it though. The last stack I need is Lucian. This guy's no flesh. I'm gonna recall here though. Alright, solid. I have ult in 10. I'm gonna ping that. Five, four. I mean, yeah. Unlucky timing. If Belmont went like this, I could have maybe went. They play Dragon. I'm gonna say that I have ult, so I am ready. I gotta push this next wave super fast, so I can ult, and the wave will just crash into the Garen's turret. Oh, he's already going. Uh, are you... Okay, in the head. Like, what is my mid laner doing? <sighs> yeah, 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 yeah. That sucks. Brahms steals this though. Unlucky. Well, the wave does at least crash and will bounce back into me, but it's not the best outcome here. No, I did not do that, so I think. What is it? No, I didn't do it.
This is some uh, pi uh, some pumped up Andrew Tate song, bro. Yo, brother. My man. Oh, get him. That's a shutdown. Karen is here, though. No in simulator today. You want to slap on the wrist, bro? Oh, I gotta be careful. Well, that's kind of game over. I don't know how I should play that because I've been one shot. Who? Huh? Because we have to path through two people to reach the Talia. Like, I don't know. It was an extremely awkward. We just saw it. I don't know. Awkward scenario there. Uh, my Caitlyn is in an okay position though. Just the Garen got two really favorable skirmishes. Frankly, because twice I tried to save a Talia that's already basically dead. So we're trying to salvage a play that's already shit. There, the best place to just let Italia die. Thanks to you, I switched the role, my man. This guy flush at least, but we are not in a good position anymore in this game. The Garen is so fat now. It's okay. We have a weak condition in Caitlyn. Caitlyn Brown can peel really good. Like, we have insane peeling this game. The best way they can kill Caitlyn is by like a volley bar Q, but we do have Brown, Shield, Shen W, and stuff like that, so we have a lot of stuff that can circumvent. We have really good peel. I flash Q there. Velvet gets a massive shutdown. Q flash, basically you drag the blade and then you flash to redirect the blade to go through it so you get the extra damage. It's good that Velvet gets it, because he's the win condition, not me. That's a really massive shutdown to get off the map. Might get the full turn from that as well. We have, we have a way better draft here, chat. Like, Caitlyn Traps, uh, Shan W, Brom Shoot, Talia E. Right, we have so many peel factors and they have, like, no good engage. So we'll, we'll outscale them draft very easily here. And I hit all the means here and Bami Cinder. I get the turret now. Ah, I pressed ult. Too late. Caitlyn is here, but so is Garen. Can you? Wait, is, is it... Okay, I'll take it. I have all my stacks now. Okay, well, the end result is good. I tried to ult on the Talia, but I honestly think it's better that my ult on Talia did not go through, and I, then I kept it. Uh, do I have merch on Tabby's? I think I need merch, yeah. Okay, next item will be Starox, which will also be very good against Garen ult and Vagar ult. So Starox is insane value here, because it's going to be hard for them to try and calculate when they would kill me with that, so that's good. Um, I have all five ultimate hunter stacks now. This turret is 1 HP. We are win. We're, we're good to the game now. He might one-shot the turret here, though. Okay, nice. I also have way more gold than him. These items are like... I mean... I like a little bit of gold ahead on him. We're good. We're 10 kill participation here, so that's nice. And our Caitlyn is very strong. She's gonna scale amazing. They have no direct threat to Caitlyn unless Volibear or Garen has, like, flesh to, like, jump on top of Caitlyn. But even then, she should outrange. And we have Talia E, Braum Shield, Shen W, all that stuff. Medium flesh there. It's gonna be 21-10 on the support. No inspiration, so you can always just calculate five minutes instantly. Wait, Garen is there all the way. Why is Garen there? For the dragon, I guess. I mean, maybe I should have done. Should have been there. The fight's already doomed now. Well, that's ugly. <clears throat> now maybe I should have been dead in the fight myself. I'm not sure.
Definitely an out ugly outcome. I didn't have ult, I should have been there. I made a mistake here. This guy's pretty fat now. I expect him to go bolt, so I'm gonna go bolt. I should match into the game for sure. Okay. Um Game is pretty even, they do have two dragons. But we have way better draft. Wait, what is these volleyball items? What? He should be sitting on so much gold. Shut up, Brace. Garen is moving. They should be careful. I'm gonna push out the side wave so that it bounces back into me and I have ult to answer. I'm looking here with ult. I think that guy might be dead already, but. Man. It's just not it. Something. Oliver flushed and Garen flushed. They get nothing from this fight. I think my team was too overextended though. This side will evoke crash and bounce back, but it's still not that good. What are you doing? Well, that's the average support play. Like, the thing is, if it was a, not the support man, I would probably question it more, but it's like, I'm not even gonna question it. It's a support player, so it's like, yeah, it's just an average average play there. A average miss, like, every now and then, you know? Happens. Don't look too deep into it. This guy's pretty tanky. Waited for the E, so my E is guaranteed. So what I did there, Chad, is kill the Lay of Shen. I queued before the fight, right? And so I already had three stacks. Even though I don't drag it through a mat, I do have three Q stacks. And then I... And then... <coughs> I waited for him to E, so I E through him. And then my three next stacks are guaranteed. He is slowed. Nah, I don't want to fight. We shouldn't fight. Why are you... Why are you looking? She either way, she's fine and she goes for the auto attack. Are you a pig or a pig? Or like, full pig. There's so many in stuff happening. Please don't come for me. Like, I'll just run away. Don't do it. You don't have to do this. Can I recall? Go as 5. Uh, mid, jungle, top, no F. Are you kidding me? The Talia really face checked. What is going on, man? <clears throat> Lucian is already pushing top now. This guy has no flush. We could do Nash. I'm down. Volley, no F. You can only ult in into the Nash pit to get in. Right? If you play against a jungler that... Ha uh, okay. Uh, Garen is here. Like, it's really, really free Nash. Nice, this is good. Nice. Now get away, get the plant, get the plant, and come back to Nash. He has no flash. He he can't he, he, he can't come. Really well played, but Velvet smited. That's not well played. And now we're gonna play for Dragon as well. Quick a Baron setup here with the bros. This guy's no flesh, no flesh. We move in here. This Vega has three health push at 21 minutes. Why is there so many different criminal things happening all at once this game? I swear. I swear! I don't know. A lot of weird things. This guy's no flesh. 
right? I'm gonna defend the tier 2 here, because Garen should keep pushing if he's smart. There we go. This Garen is pretty smart though, he knows what he's doing. Emilio isn't. Baited them all, I still have Sterox, so it's not even close. It looks close, but look, I have Sterox. Obi, baby. <laughs> Gotta dodge this Q here. Or just run it, and I get the kill. Thank you. Well, chat! Good carry here, honestly. We have, we, have, we have a few weak moments, a few slower moments, but hey, now the game is amazing. Get away from my wave, piggy. Actually, we can push here. I have ult. We had some minor setbacks with this with this piggy mainly, Mr. Nixu, but uh, we're in a good spot now. And we have the superior drafts, right? Again, none of their champions are like a, like Lucian can't play. Bromq kills, Talia E kills, like Belvin is super strong now. Our draft is infinitely better than theirs. There's the volley flash gone. He has no ult. Talia is taking turret aggro. I find it uh, entertaining. But good. Volibear no flash, so who's gonna get on Caitlyn? Who's gonna get on Talia? Well, we have Brom defend, my defense, Talia E, Caitlyn has traps, Belvin is a knock up. There's too many things that we have to kite any of their fights, so that their comp is just severely outdrafted here. Unless my teammates just run it. It's the only way we lose. Vega still has a health potion. Last redeem. Okay, give me a second. What song is this? I'm Sterox. You and me, Talia. GG. I like this build a lot. We're, we're getting some better games though. I have Titanic Haja, I have Sunfire, and then there's two Fredericos, and they somehow get it. Like, suck my fat nuts. Okay, this is some very chill, calm music. Okay. No, we got coached yesterday a little bit on the builds and runes and items to get. Uh, well, build is items, right? So, they had that. And uh, we'll get coached by Petu soon for the Shen. Oh, let's get out. Do I need magic resist? It's only the Vagar and I have Merc, so I don't think I need to. I'm gonna go Deadman's. Four attack speed, by the way. With balance. Clarity is cooking up some random songs. I don't think full AP Shen is really good. I would highly recommend against Sunfire. I think the Titanic Iceborne or Sundered are two better core items. I'm Master Shen for the reference. Iceborne is very gold efficient. Sheen item on Shen is nice. Okay, so what I could do... Petu recommended going Sterak second. So it's sun, uh, or Titanic into Sterak. I could go Sunfire, or not instead of Sunfire, I could go, uh, what's the item called? Um, can't think of it. Iceborne. But I think sitting on Bobby Cinder lane is still really good. Okay, so I just sit on the Bobby Cinder, but don't upgrade. That's good then.
Okay, I actually want to continue watching this video about how Professor Akali ruined his reputation because I still think it's interesting. Professor Akali touched the feeling of going FK6 in the road just to make a change. Akali may visit Iron. Okay, yeah. the video louder for you guys This I can understand, of course. That I can understand, of course. Yo, Walter. Uh, we're playing against Gnar. I think I'll just keep this room page. Like, Flesh of Night is working. I'm gonna keep with this. <laughs> the reverse Ash E or Ash W, whatever that was, in like a different color is a banger, though. Farming people in a custom game and passing another rank. I mean, if you do that kind of content, I can understand why you just lose your credibility as a content creator. That, that makes no sense, of course. That, that absolute. That's, yeah, that's just not smart to do. Not smart to do at all. Do we go D blade chat? Okay, chat. Type one if we should go D blade. Type two if we should go D shield. Yo, yo, Tar. We're doing, we're doing good. We're chilling. First time chatting. Never played League before. I will be installing this game today. Low. Wish me luck. Good luck, boss. You're about to lose your luck. No. Oh yeah, the music is very loud, sorry. E so, wait a second, chat. Okay, everybody was like D-Blade, right? Okay. No! Don't get into this cursed game! <laughs> Bro, League of Legends players are like smokers. Everybody that smokes is like telling everybody, no, don't smoke, don't smoke, it's bad for you. No, 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 don't smoke, it's bad for you. You get lung cancer, you get this, that, you know, it's bad for you. League of Legends players, when somebody says, oh, I want to get into this game. No, no, please don't do it, it's bad for you. You're gonna, you're gonna get addicted, your mental's gonna go down the drain, you're gonna be chronically online, you're never gonna touch the grass again, and your life is ruined. Guys, we need some appreciation for League of Legends. It's an amazing game. Come on. 
with some more positivity. It's an amazing game. And we can be the change that we want to see in the game. Genuinely, we need more we need more appreciation for this game. There's so many good things about this game. There are so many good things about this game. Yo, Felix, good to see you, bro. League is factually worse than smoking crack cocaine. <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean, bro. I could have been somebody if it wasn't for League of Legends. Uh -huh. I <coughs> <coughs> what he said I come from fighting games nothing can be more toxic than Tekken can it buddy you're in for a ride League of Legends is very toxic Wait, we're stuck by the way. What's going wrong? This is loading though, so I don't think it's my fault. Yo, Mike, send me your song, bro. I've played in high MMR around six games, and League is by far the most toxic, yeah. What's this, Walter? I know what he means. The chat this game is amazing. Disturb decadence. All right. Um, let's continue. Oh, we're getting flagged as AFK. Um, Doran's bleed. Doran's clean. Unter oh, I oh, imagine I'm here. Imagine I'm here. Oh, chat, this is your fault. Walter, it's your fault. Send me a stupid, stupid Twitter thing. Oh wait, I'm not even on the right scene. Chat, there's a whole. F Bro, going on. Doris Blade! Start speaking German. Genau, we gehen gewinnen! Ich habe kein Q. One melee, one cast, and I get my level 2, by the way, chat. He's not ready for this. He does have bomb blighting. Oh, he got level three, I'm dead. I'm dead.
I was already in front ahead of you guys. Shut up, okay? Like, you guys have a lot to say. It. All right, I gotta focus now, though. Nara, no TP, and I do that play. Cringe. <clears throat> All right, we're fine because I got a first blood, but still prefer behind. I at least lose almost no XP, so that's all right. We at least lose while the wave is pushing towards. We at least died when the wave is pushing towards us, so it's like it's doable. He had no flash TP, and I died. Kind of cringe. Okay, we get a good recall. I'm gonna go long short Ruby uh, Crystal 2. Oh. Nice, Nar slow pushing, so I won't lose much here. That's good as well. He's gonna be level 6 in though. He's on here. I saw a glimpse of him. Okay. Uh, not a good trade. <laughs> Why do I have D-Blade again, chat? Who told me to go D-Blade? Um, can mods search up the logs and whoever, you know, typed one, can we just prevent all of them, actually? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's how we treat uh, people that treat me wrong. Wow, Nar. Wow, Nar. Wow, you're so good at the game. Get Jake mold, bro. Jens mold. All right, we got a hard push, aka start hitting this wave as fast as I humanly can to push this wave and to push next wave in as well. I'm lucky I get to kill Velkus at an amazing roam, he's the GOAT. And uh, yeah, we're gonna reset here. He should not have TP yet. I need to E into him and then Q. I keep Qing, like, and, and then Eing in, and then I don't have my Q because I just mistimed it. I need to manage the cooldowns way better. Alright, we're gonna finish Tabis. Uh, I think I just have to accept that I lose a full wave here. Whatever. It is what it is. He just that checks me too hard. Uh, the wave is still frozen. That's is time problem. Yeah, we have a problem here. We lose two full waves, but what can I do about it? Long call, oh, thank you for the prime boss, yeah, man. Yeah. Appreciate it, brother. Easy. I 
I feel like if you play Flash Ignite Shen and you die once, your game will feel horrible Hello to play. Guys, I'm like, Today we are gonna do absolutely horrible. Hey, TV, thank you for Prime as well. Do you speak better German as a Dutchman? All right, girl. If you, are you German? Okay. Any German people in my chat that can speak Dutch? Any any German people in my chat that can speak Dutch? What is this one-sided traffic, bro? Shut your mouth. That's better trading by me. I space like everything, but of course it has to land the ult. Wait, let me get drunk. Shut up. Why wow, just predicts me? I was kind of obvious too, though. <sighs> oh! Sorry. Upsetting. Using flesh ignite and getting nothing. It's like cleaning the dishes for your mom and then not being rewarded. What? I make so many mistakes this game. It's all your work. You're a lord then. Shut up. Well, go in. He's all to the second. Wait, I missed time. Alright, Lord then call me noob. You deserve like you you've earned it. Wait, right, I'm actually dead, aren't I? Alright, plus 69, baby. Give me that shit. Is Facebook working in your country right now? Bro, who uses Facebook anymore? Are you like a 59-year-old dad? Kidding. Alright, this game we got carried. This game I played bad. I struggle against range champions for sure the most. Like... I think I just ran it down though, so... Now game's easy. There's more people dying for grubs. It's like, oh guys, it's grub season. Everybody, let's int. Oh, it's in a clot tower. Actually, that clot tower is so shit. I should just keep my money. Mario, take me a primer. Hey, Alois, can't wait for the vein to master. Alright, mods, get him out of here. Yes, Mundo's pretty good into volley. Uh, into Scion. I'm not sure into volley there. Thoughts of climbing with Vayne top? It works. But you lower your self-respect. Does that make sense? How what I can compare Vayne top to? It's like getting rich by doing OnlyFans. If you climb with Vayne top, it's exactly like getting rich by doing OnlyFans. Yeah, can you really say you did your job though? I don't know. That guy's good. Losing it up to Ever Prime. I missed my Q again.
Nou i. Torrens blinkt! Oude! Oh, my bad. You guys know who a good coach is? Quarry, do stay with your one. That guy is good. Get me out of this game. I'm, I'm mentally already next game, chat. I'm mentally already next game. Go! Holy shit. How many pings do you need, man? Like, they, they were walking into you, and then he ults, like... I don't know, try to score between everybody, I guess. I'm getting annoyed by this game, chat. This, this game is gonna send me into a mental depression. Please don't tell me he gets to kill Warwick. Oh, no, stop. Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? I'm baiting, I'm baiting, I'm baiting, I'm baiting, I'm baiting. I'm baiting. Okay. We gotta refocus. I'm gonna eat some nuts. It will calm me down. Eating food is good. No, oh, we're losing this game, by the way. I'm solo losing this game at the moment, so let's stop doing that. Let's refocus. Re-establish the focus here. And let's win this game. Be right back. Sexy horse. Holy shit, that guy. I'm just clearing this wave chat. Nothing wrong there. Warwick! Warwick Sama! Warwick Us! Thank you. That guy's overcooking. I can't type to anybody or anything because I am the biggest pick this game. I just want out. I just want out. This game is not this game was not my performance, okay? Let's go to the songs. Alright, get him, knee tax. Get that guy. Get him. Alright, we got a flush. Uh oh, wait, work left. Cancel two autos, missed my Q through my opponents. Chat, this is the hardest champion in the game. Shen is the hardest champion in the game, if your name is Alois. It's fine. You know, the one kill I have this game chat is also from the level 1. I don't know if I should have said that. The other issue with this game is my entire team is stomping, so my minions are 3% stronger, but I'm clearly struggling. Like, I'm, I'm collecting breadcrumbs on the street at the moment. But sexy horse. Yay! Oy, oy! That is all me, baby! Hey, look at the top! I don't want to talk about it.
Look at that top laner. Beautiful form. Five out of five ultimate hunter stacks. Well done, Alois. I know. <sighs> that top laner. That top laner. Wasn't all my support. That top laner, man. Yeah, I do think I need to play the champion just way slower and way less for kills and like just play for short trades instead of eating into my opponent like a, like an like a like an ape, and then we'll be fine. Oh please, just let me get the turret, man. I think my E is bugged on the champion for some reason. It always misses. Kind of similar thing to what I had with Yorick. Like a bug on my E sometimes. I don't know. Why is splitting sideline not viable for Shen? Because I don't push turrets. Look at this top cap though. Damn. Damn, look at that top cap. Alright, let's move on this guy. Easy. Chat, I have an issue. There's an issue! But I won't say for who. Please release me, 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 Shit! Shit! Sorry, it happens. If only I had my D blade, I'd probably win actually. <sighs> Jens Maul mauled me. What can I do about it? Nothing. It happens. Sorry for your ears. Um. Uh, nothing else to say. Imagine judging, no? Sorry. It's fine, I have sexy horse on the Seroth. He'll fix it for me. If anybody flames my wallop, I'm permabanning you. Foundamentos. Yeah. Thank you for the tier one, buddy. I appreciate it. Okay, chat, next game I'm gonna like be hyper, 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 hyper focused, okay? Like I'll I, I won't make a single mistake. I'm done inting on this champion and platinum MMR. Like I, I'm losing lane so often. Like I, I'm genuinely losing lane. A little, little, little more often than than I, I would want to admit. Okay. So let's do something about it. Yeah, Mr. Lambchop, Ergot has been. Oh, Mama, you ex. You now, if. Okay. Uh, yes, let Mr. Lambchop, Ergot has been in two votes right now, or in two polls, and nobody voted him, so. Sure. I have some other content ideas, though. Because the unranked to master, the majority of the content I have is like Emerald Plus. I have a new series that I'm gonna make on YouTube, off stream mainly. And I'm gonna make educational content on every top laner. So I have some ideas. Let's see. Hello, boss. Under to master and lockstop feels good. Not gonna lie. Yeah, bro. Let me just play lockstop and lose the game level one because I can't access my wave and then cry for jungle gangs and then get outskilled. Can't play side lane. Can't group because I'm a top laner. That sounds really good. Look at the top gap. Top gap. Yo, DPS fam, good to see you, boss. Thank you so much, man. Thank you for the kind words. Could have maybe altered, but hey, priorities here on the side lane. Thank you so much, Mr. Fab, for your kind words. There we go. I got some would say that I had a better general in this game, but I'm the reason this work is fed. I gave NAR kills, and then I gave kills to Warwick when NAR had kills. So Warwick got more gold and EXP. I will, I will kill this guy. I won't kill this guy. Let's back off. Let's play for Baron chat. Or team, rather. Don't think I can force chat to play uh, for Baron with me. Gents, you're kiting away from your setup, buddy. 
Top gap. Top gap. Top gap. Top gap. All right, Karma, come here. See what happens. You guys ready? Are you guys ready? GG. Wait, do I die? Easy. Look at that side step too. I'll kill this guy. I'll kill the Chili Peppers guy. He doesn't know yet. I'm gonna bait. You're baiting him? My cane is coming. I have to run. What if we kill Vincent, chat? Do you guys have faith in me? Do you guys believe in me? I'm gonna bait him. He needs to see me though. Ah, whatever. Let's recall. End of the game. Play for Baron. End the game, man. End the game. <laughs> Aquaridis, you're such a nice chatter, man. The rest is, are pigs. It's okay. This work is sitting on like 3k gold or something. Zero! Thank you for the primer. Thank you for the eight. Appreciate you, Zero. I hope you're doing amazing. You and Tizer are doing amazing. Oh, yeah, he bought way more than that. Alright, what about this chat? That's a good emo to use. Wait, what did I say? What was what did I say that was wrong? Gents. Streamer landed the taunt. Pretty impressive. He's getting top gapped right here. GG. What about us? Well, I, I asked you guys something. Did you have faith? And I was like, I saw like seven no's and one y and one yes. So very very easy choosing there. This guy typed yawn in all chat. That's just cringe. Thank you, Zero. I'm not, I'm not all right. Thank you for asking. And thank you for the primer. I appreciate it. We got 300 tokens from this too. 300 pesos. So we got yeah, stairs. Yo, Jerome! See you, bro. Is this a Shending help stream now? Bro, I'm like. Shend you have Shending help and expat too, and then there's Alois and Al. And uh, for some reason, apparently Shen is like my. How do you call it? Well, this is gonna be the hardest challenge probably. I'm not good at this champion. That that that's just that's just the plain truth. I'm not good at this champion. I'll I'll get better though, but I gotta actually focus. Next game, I've said that I, I won't be making mistakes. I see a demoderation. <gasps> Chat, do you see what I see? GG. Level 16 shield is gonna be massive here. So let's get that fast. We are in trouble, but we have Sterox. Top gap. The Sterox shoot, baby! I actually lived tanking three people. Well, he's one in 12. But this, like, I, I, dude, Stellar definitely makes this champion a monster, though. Like, I'm surprised I lived there. I thought I was dead, too, right? Which I should have been. Alright, we're extended. My support dealt so much damage this game. Protect. Oh, mama. Next game will be better, okay? Handshake on that. Please end the game already. Shen gameplay is boring when I int, and I'm inting a lot, so... Are they not ending, by the way? Are they not ending, or like, what is going on? I'll reconnect. Did we somehow not end? What's going on? Why, why did I ever leave a game? Bad decision. Yes, we'll get coached by Pet too. Oh, look at this. The game is loading and the game has stopped loading. Oh, lovely.
I can't exit that door. Close with door. No. I've signed out by accident, of course. Okay, let me sign back in chat. My bad. Next game, I'm gonna go full focus because I'm kind of annoyed with my gameplay. In a way. I'm gonna go toilet quickly f as well, get some <clears throat> chill. Alright. Okay, I think everything is fixed. Alright. Next game is gonna be better, okay? Okay. Deal. Handshake. Let's go. Next game will be good. <clears throat> Let's go chat. I am Bina back, okay? I'm gonna turn on this video. We're watching uh, how uh, this guy uh, lost his reputation. So, I'm Bina back. Okay, your boy's back. The gang of the plank, I'm here. No, I'm, I'm just watching this video chat for, for my own education too. I think it's entertaining and I want to learn from other people's mistakes. Why would you get involved with that stuff as well? <laughs> Bro, how can people be like so, so contradictory? He is exposing somebody for doing a thing that he wanted himself. Like how cringe. Wait, I need to re-listen to this. I like, I, I need to fathom this. Crazy. Well, I got jungle. Can I, can I top? I don't want to play Shen jungle, I think. Shen one trick. <laughs> 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 
That's a weird one too. Have a Shen one trick. Uh, I'm not the play. I can jungle. All right, it's a jungle game. I've been velvet. What jungles do we have, Chad? What What are our options? What are our options? High key, I want to play Master Yi. Bro, I'm playing a game of Master Yi. That's what I want to do. I'll play a game of Master Yi. I'll use some jungle fundamentals and I'll be my uh, I'll unleash my inner scenarios. Low pros. Let me search scenarios room page. I've never played Master Yi in my life, but that, that shouldn't stop me from playing Master Yi. All right, for people who don't know scenarios, this guy is the GOAT when it comes to jungle. He's uh, rank 31 right now. He is higher now, he was like rank 3 earlier. So what runes does he take? THE PANT MASTER YE ARE YOU Oh, oh, thank you bro. Oh, he let me. He let me chat, he let me top. Okay, we're fine, we're chilling, we're being chilling. We, have to, we don't have to compensate. Yeah, 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 he's bad, my bad, bro. All right, we're chilling, we're chilling, we're chilling. I want to finish this video. True. Okay, we're playing as Yorikus. So, this matchup is pretty good for me. Um, until he gets level 6. So, we gotta try and destroy this matchup pre-6. And we need to not, like, he, he's one of the highest gold income champions. I'm one of the lowest gold income champions, right? So, that can be scary too. Alright, let's finish watching this. I feel like once, once you're like, the community hates you, it's like GG, you know, like there's no going back. All right. Uh, all right, let's focus. Okay, Chad, this is the game I set that I like, I don't want to have excuses anymore of anything. I just want to be fully in my element of focus and um, do my best. So let's go. Next match, Jarek will win at six. That's how hard he will is, is, uh... Oh, okay, but they, they they are buffing the Maiden even, right? Okay, so this guy's playing the Conqueror setup, not the First Strike setup, so he can trade a little bit more with me. He's probably playing Bone Plating too. Let's focus. I mean, matchup in mid lane is really good for us. Uh, Sway should get hard prime to Talia, especially with Ignite. Uh, we have Nunu against Echo Jungler. Echo's pretty weak in the early game, in general, in jungle ganking. Like, I have a really easy time avoiding his ganks. But I gotta memorize that I cannot look to E out of his W and his um, W as well. I could maybe cheese the Yorick here. He's gonna walk through here, I have a feeling. Maybe tree cheese him. He gave me free access to this. Unless he somehow walked past, I think he's gonna leash. Because it's an echo jungle and I can get a massive cheese off. There we go. Jaguar blade through him. 
There's his bone blading out. Nice. And now he's like this shoot, okay? I went D blade Yorick every game, so it's interesting to see D shoot Yorick here. But now I'm gonna try and just zone him from the first remains worth of XP. No bone plating. He's not respecting my authority here. So you'll take some damage. Like that. And he's pushed the wave. So the wave is pushing into me, chat. But he's already down a shit ton of HP and his potion, right? So I am fine with the wave pushing into me. And the reason as to why is because it's gonna force the York to walk up for less. I wanna drive my blade through him again and then go in. But if this York is forced to walk up for less hits, then he's always gonna be in trouble, right? Level two here. One, two, three. Lovely. Now the wave is gonna push back into me, but he spawned the homies. I'm gonna keep these homies alive because they're gonna push the wave for him. I've played enough Yorick to know that if you keep those alive, they'll actually push the wave. So now, by keeping these alive, the wave is pushing into me, but look at Yorick. Does he, do you feel like this guy wants to walk up for last hits? Absolutely not. There you go, baby. Why the males? And, you know, the thing is, because I've played so much Yorick myself, now I can spot these patterns super easily. I just, oh, he spawned the homies? Oh, that's a mistake, you know? In the past, I would not be able to notice that. So there's some extra champion knowledge, too, that I've gained from playing these... Uh, Trick. So now the only thing I need to be thinking about right now is I have to set up my own reset, right? I'm not playing with TP, so I don't have the luxury that he is that I can just TP back. So now the only job or idea in my mind is I want to reset. And in a general sense, you want to reset whenever the wave is pushing into you. So I'm going to slow push this wave. Level 3 here. I'm very glad I have my E. There we go. Should be alright. Like I said, all I need to do is think about setting up my reset. But it can be, or it can prove a little tricky here. Especially losing my HP like this. Alright. Uh, it's hard to play the bounce here, but Yorick is at least below half mana, so... Uh, and he has not even hit level 4, I'm gonna reach his entire wave. But it's just hard to get my reset in here. He just hit level 4, okay. The means are gonna focus, or the turret's gonna focus the means first, so I can take this for free. I'm gonna prioritize my auto attack on this, so I can get this, and now my next Q auto will take this. Very nice. Prioritize this one. Oh, I missed. Click there. Okay, so now I'm gonna get my level 5 faster, and I'm gonna be able to build a wave here, and I'm gonna utilize the wave stacking to get the crash here. All I need is to get my reset in. It's hard to get here, but. Oh, please tell me I get the cannon still. Nice. I can trade here. This Q's on cooldown. My W here. He's out of mana now. Completely. So I don't mind this trade too much. Because now it's going to give me free press in the lane. I find them unworthy. You want this cannon, buddy? That's what I thought. His Q is 20 mana. His E's, I think, 45. Hello guys. Also, if you Hello. make Yorick use W, he runs out of mana so fast, because it's 70 mana, way too high. I maybe should have slow pushes, actually. It's like, kind of stuck here, but he's gonna let it crash. Nice. Yo, Nero Sun, thank you for Prime, I appreciate it, thank you for five months. The wave's gonna bounce back into me now. Yorick does not have enough wave clear to push this out, so... Getting Rico here is amazing. I'm gonna buy this in boots, we're gonna run it back. And now the wave is gonna slow push towards me. But Yorick does not have enough pushing power to push it out, even if he spawns the homies here. So we're gonna get a freeze here at, at, at minimum. And if York stays, we might get a kill as well. All right, he's gonna spawn the homies, but these are actually gonna keep the like he's, these are gonna keep pushing for them. And he's kind of he's, he's in a bad scenario here. I only lost one million worth of XP here, so I really like the early game here. Leave it a prime. <coughs> Not Bami Cinder. I think rushing Titanic makes more sense because after six, like he's just gonna brainlessly push wave, and I want wave clear as well. ASAP. Wait, Echo Gang bot and still hasn't recalled. Do I ult this guy? No. Echo still hasn't recalled. York has already lost a full cannon wave here, which is 200 gold and also all the XP, so we are in an amazing spot here. Ah! If anybody flames my wallop, I'm perma banning you. Potato. Persona, take a prime. Potato indeed. Bijou. Good W as well. Wave still pushing towards me. 
It's gonna he's no flash for one minute, right? I'm gonna slow with my Q here. There we go. Oh, that was a really good W by him. Well played. I'm putting him somewhat in execution range though. He hit level six, but we're 20 CS up. So we've done what we're set out to do, right? Which is win the early game. He has no W. I have boots. We're fine. Get extra range. Bomba. Gotta last at the mating here for 50 gold. <laughs> do I ult here? Nah, I'm not gonna ult for that. I'm gonna ult for that though, but Echo is ult. Wait, the E still goes through. I tried to E him when he's. Uh, and now I don't get to push out as well. Oh my, that is so bad. I get nothing for my ults. I mean, my ult should have been fast. I don't know. My E should have been faster, but like he eat and the inside locked onto his target. I thought I would still have time to like, whilst he eat that I like taunt him and then his E duration ends, but uh, we learn. Inside goes out, I guess, so I should E preventively. My bolt is my win condition here that I can... Try to play four. He's gonna freeze us. I don't want that. A potion to stay full HP. We're Q delay here, so I get three Q stacks. Need to get this wave in. Okay. Mid is getting. Goomba stomped. That's is not good. I do think my champ is pretty good against Kiara though. At least my bottle is farming well. Uh, the rest of the draft is just looking pretty bad. Oh, please tell me we win the skirmish. Nice. Well, we're still 2 0 up and, and like. 20 something CS, so we're still in a really good position in top lane. I'm playing for that. My old, my first ult was bad though. Okay. In games like this, you do really want to make sure that the ult you use has to be look good. Like, it's like playing Nocturne. If your first ult is bad, it's like you lose so much control over the game. Okay, nice. That is so massive. Okay, my team won't have skirmish without me. And gold is in Samira, which is the best part to get it. Yoda gets his ult in a second. He's still super weak though. What is he buying? Eclipse? Oh, okay, nice. My team won skirmishes around bot side. Amazing, well done. Okay, we get a weak addition to the bot lane. I probably want to get this bone plating off first here with the TM out. There we go. Then I have my Q. But he wasted WQ. Nice. Play for his mana pool. I, of course, have infinite mana, so I can always utilize that. It both means. It's only the Kiana that's our wing condition now. There's the Maiden. He can't really progress much here though. There's so much shut down, shut down, shut down, shut down. Everybody has a shut down. What is this? Shut down, shut down, shut down. And what the hell is this? It's a full on ghetto bro in this game, man. Okay, he has no homies right now. Every minute that dice is gonna jump me because he eat me. I would like a Nuna gank. Do I ult here? Please live. Oh, I think this is worth it. I'm gonna lose so many plates, but my AD carry is my win condition, right? So, like... The Draven dying in those type of scenarios, like, first of all, I kill a Draven. So that, that guy is already, like, minus 50 mental, right? So that's already a good thing. And then again, I'm already 2-0 up against the Yorick, so I value... So Yorick gets, like, 250 gold here, but Samira gets 300 gold and the wave, and I deny Draven gold. So I think that... That... Yeah, that is just way better, right? For the game. You are a facilitator... As Shen, you are a facilitator, not a solo carry yourself. 
I tried to flush. That's just not good. And Yorick is back in the game. He gets a fetch shot down. Oh shit. I shouldn't play like that. I'm trying to explain and play at the same time. Well, we get that at least. Never a good idea. Wait, my pike is faker. Wait a second, who is that guy? Yo, we have Davemon on the draft. Wait a minute. Graguzzi lover. Get him, babe. My mid lane gets a lot at least. I lose a lot. Yorick gets a lot. I mean, maybe it's alright. Samira should just recall though. Please don't die. Okay, well, it was worth it. At the end of the day, it's worth what happened, so, okay. But I only have one point left, and my Samira should have reset. She didn't reset after the play. Ah, oh, Brace, shut up. I'm explaining my thought process to you guys on to why I ulted. I have three ultimate hunter stacks, I need Echo Zyra. My mid lane has gotten four plates because Kiara was top, so that's good. This guy is rushing Hydra still, and Tabby's at No ult on it. What is that play? You're just dead too. Okay, but my bot lane has a double kill. It's fine. I just played by my bot lane. My mid jungle are like... But my bot lane is good, so we play for bot lane. Echo could gank me here, so I gotta be a little bit careful. I can't be too aggressive with my E here. It's fine, I'm gonna walk here so the homies jump me. It's funny that I know exactly how Yorick works now. I mean funny, but like I know in the past that I did just didn't really know how the goose worked and stuff like this, but now I know exactly how it works. Yo, go blood. 940, but he's Tabby, so I can't really kill him easily. I have ult here. Okay. Him dying was maybe better, else I just lose my food turret. I don't know, I'm doing my best, but my jungler is really, really making this game not easy. Mid lane 2. This is gonna be bot lane. I shouldn't ult for a Nunu. I shouldn't ult for 2 and 6 Nunu. That should be like a conscious decision before I make it. Like before even ulting, I should be anticipating. I'm like, okay, my Nunu is super weak. I should never ult for him. I should only be ulting for bot lane this game. That's the second ult I've basically wasted on this Nunu. Still really good damage. I'm gonna wait for him to walk through my blade here. And then I'll drag it and kill him. He's paying attention to it. Ooh. Also, I ulted just before hitting level 11, with his, which is a mistake in its own. Well... I'm gonna try and flip it here, I think, chat. No, never mind. He's getting his bone plating back. Even me killing him is not really changing the outcome of the game here. I'm just slowly dying to the maiden, actually. If he kills me, it, it is it is the end of the game for me, though, because I'm, I'm never going to be stronger than him again anymore. What a brainless champion Yorick is, man. Why would you play Yorick? Man, you're a Yorick player, you're such a pig. I think my turn is gone.
I'll go with this side to end this game. Bro, there's 50 kills this game in 16 minutes. I think Kiana benefits from that. Samira's also... I don't know. My pike is strong as well. Do I want to ult for the pike though? No. What is, what is going on this game? It is such a disgusting mess. I don't want to ult for that guy. That's a rule we have. We only ult for Samira. We ult for Samira. I don't have my E. Decent. I'm gonna have to help him. He died like that. That's a gruesome death. Saw me, baby. Did not have to flash, but hey, we'll take it. Let's go, baby. Do I have my item? I do. All right, let's get it. There is uh, 60 kills now, almost, chat. <laughs> So wait, 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 is, there, is somebody dying every 20 seconds? Hey, yeah, yeah, this is my wave, buddy. Yeah. Is somebody dying every 20 seconds? I think so. <clears throat> 60, yeah, somebody's dying every 20 seconds-ish. It's crazy. Samira's just randomly soloing this dragon. What a mess this game is. <laughs> Nunu goes well played, so I'm gonna go kind of your job next time. <laughs> Should I even flash? I'm gonna time that, so it's gonna be 23.50. I can almost one-shot this guy, I feel like. He sees my blade, though. Oh, there it is again. There's that thing. One, two... Confidence, baby! Stop sucking me! Stop sucking me, you bad wife! Bad bitch! Sorry, I... Uh, oh, I'm, I'm, uh. Okay, my bad. Uh, I think I could have played a little bit more efficient. Uh, so, the reason I felt safe when wearing the Yorick is one thing I knew I had no flash. And I had my I had dragged my blade through him, so I know I was dealing extra damage in that fight. And, um, what's it called? The second part to that was that I had my Q back up again as well. I right, you can do this. Oh. It's actually live, though. This spike, this spike is absolutely smurfing, bro. Oh, this game is hard. That's a storm surge. My mid jungle are just uh, piggies. Makes the game hard. Um, what is Aloy's doing? Baiting. There's 70 kills in 21 minutes! This game is a mess! A hot mess! Like you're. I don't know. Worth it though. Mr. Fundamentals, found you through YouTube Shorts. Glad to see you live. Yo, Deco to wave. Good to see you, boss man. Hope you enjoy your stay. This game is such such a disgusting. Then this Nunu, <laughs> the form ten Nunu, has a shutdown out of everybody. This game. 
<laughs> like, what's going on, man? This, this is somehow gonna turn into a disaster. Echo, you're gonna get like a quadruple kenta, penta kill here somehow. I don't know, man. All right, I think we actually get it. <laughs> I hope. Key RTP. Uh oh. Wait. Maybe not. Hello, guys. I'm oh Today shit! Please, 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 please just get it. Please, just. Play. I have a bad feeling. I have a bad feeling. I have a bad feeling. Okay. All right, I'll take it. Is it worth? No. But it's off the map. Frappy thing for the prime. Appreciate it. We're gonna push our bot wave and reset the side wave. You're just gonna get the tier 2 though, but nothing I can do about that really. They would get that if I'm there or not. I guess this is the average like emerald game. No, not too shabby. 80 kills, minute 22. Pretty solid. It's just that I'm playing a champion that... I mean, I don't mind this place not too much, I guess. Echo Eid. Like, Ultim. What? That's his Nikut! Why would he do that? Why would he risk this shutdown to kill a... There is too many questions about this game. This game needs to be studied by 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 ancient ancient historians. There's 80 games at minute 23. <laughs> I feel like the average is even though the death timers are going up, like the amount of average kills is, is going up as well per per like minute. I don't know how that's working out. Everybody's just dying every time. Because you're smelly. Oh, my bad then. My bad. Everybody's double digit deaths in a second. I I don't know. I only have four deaths. That's definitely below the average. Less Baron buff, maybe? We can't even utilize the Baron buff. Well, this guy is full built because he has 18 kills. I, I, I'm as Shen, by the way. I have the highest farm this game. It's not even like I'm consciously playing for farm either. I'm not thinking about sideways, I just have the most farm because everybody is continuously skirmishing. Alright, we're level 16 now. Wait, why does my Samira only have two items? I thought this guy was way stronger. Wait, what? This guy's like, no more. It's the pike that has. The pike is full build. No, that's not good. I'm doing my best hitting him. Okay, that was a flush. Nice one. Everybody's dead. Do we just lose the game now? Wait. Oh, uh, ironically. Don't worry, thank you, Prime. Um. What? The hell is this game? I hit the me and for the extra proc there. Oh, we just lost. We, we just lost. I think I played really well. Not like, not like perfect or anything, but like I think I played really well. Oh, Shen is so hard. I don't know. My genre was Autofilto, he gave me his role. This Yorick did nothing. I, I'm 2k gold up at the end of the game. We're just 5k gold down here, 5k gold down in jungle. Like, no, 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 hard to win. It's, it was like me and Pike, kind of. Play for split push. I'm Shen against a Yorick, you want me to play for split push? It's like, it's like... I mean, what, what, I, can't, I, can't, I can't think of something on the fly, but that's like not, not very efficient or not very intelligent. No, you don't play Shen to split push, in the general sense. 
At the YouTube, uh, YouTube viewer here, I went from 9 years bronze silver to plat 1 after coaching from coach Curtis slash Nathan Jungle. Now I'm playing top 8 of the season after watching many of your videos and I placed in plat 1 again against people I have no business playing against in top all just fundamentals, mostly wave management, level 2, 3, 4 spikes. Thank you for all the advice and content. Thank you so much, bad decision, Dan. I appreciate that, bro. Your journal need to apply... Your jungler didn't need to play AP new. No, 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 it's not on me, of course. Keiji, take you the primer. Any opinion on better top? I think it's suboptimal. <laughs> well, it's okay. Oh, Shen Challenge is gonna be one of the hardest for sure. Playing a tank in solo queue is always like hard, right? I've said this before. I don't like playing tanks in solo queue because you are you are reliant on your environment for your success as a tank player, so you will always have that aspect playing tanks. Alright, Ben Aatrox. Shen is a team reliant champion that works better than higher modes. That's exactly how I feel like. Trying to climb on Shen and Plot Emerald is infinitely more stressful than Diamond 2 Plus. That's how I feel like as well. I feel like the higher I go, the more easy it will be. But I do have to play my matchups better too. I do definitely have to play my matchups better too. Alright, let's just focus on the fine manos and we'll do fine. That's what we're gonna do. That is what we're going to do, chat. Right, another one. Why Grip X fell off and disappeared? This is so interesting to watch for me. It's all these old content creators. This is people that I used to watch before I like really was like changing and stuff like this. Is, is Faker known for his LeBlanc? Okay, my bad. <laughs> Kled. I feel like that matchup is decent... D d speak. Decently doable because of my W. Let's go. Wait, he was the early inventor of shorts. Gripex was such a wholesome streamer to watch. I remember watching him. I remember being like super young and like watching his stream just because I like, I don't know, was like just chilling watching his stream. I remember. Yeah. I don't know. It's weird. He's playing TP. Uh, bro, I, I'm stuck in platinum in on this champion, man. We get a Senna, Aphelios, both a Heimer, Gragas, mid jungle, and they get like a cane. This is gonna be like so 50 50 how this game goes. Alright, I'm just gonna do my best. I'm gonna do my best. Uh, uh, I'm just gonna hard focus on top lane fundamental shit. So. Let's just super tunnel on my laning phase. I'm going to explain everything that I do regarding that. So we're playing against Kane Klet here. Kane is a very cheesy jungler. He very often does third wave or third camps into gank, but it's usually on red side. So it is like Raptors, Rep of Krug, something like that, and then ganks. So my mid lane and bot have to be very scared of early ganks. I'm not too scared. Or Kane could invade early on the rep of like this. I'm going to move here. Kled as a champion is not that strong level 1, but level 2 with his W is where all his damage comes from, right? 
Turn the music down. Yes, sir. Got you. Sorry. Bro, how can you talk so much? That's what I do. I make a living yapping. Alright, we're gonna leave a late ward here, just so I have a ward against the cane, so I can, uh, uh, what's it called, so I can scout him. So, chat, if you guys don't know, Klet's W isn't controllable. It's just, a, like, it's just an active, basically, and it will trigger on the first auto tech he does, once he has selected the ability and it's off cooldown. Once he uses it, it will go on a cooldown, but then again, the first auto tech he does, when his sword is glowing, it will proc it, so he cannot manually control his W. That's an important thing to know about the clap matchup. There's even master players that don't know this, okay? So it's important to know that. And he's playing D-Blade here, and even though this is a realistic, you know, Hard matchup, you know, it's a clad, very strong early game champion. If I get my level 2 first, if I get my level up timer first, I am going to be in a better position than him because any losing matchup can become winnable if I get my level 2 first. Now, I'm going to be aiming to drag my blade through him because it's going to give me attack speed and extra damage. You see how fast I hit? It's the attack speed I'm talking about. <coughs> I'm going to use my Q here to get away priority. And now we're going to focus on this melee minion because this melee minion will give me my level 2. Then... I'm gonna drag my blade through him here. Okay, I actually missed. I'm gonna get him off his horse and wait for my next Q. And then I wanna jump onto him. He's, he's gonna have his W now. Okay, well, that sucks. You see his glow, sword is glowing. There's his W. And this is alright because now he cannot get his horse for him back. He is E and W. I know that. Or Q and W. Well, that was a little close. The wave is pushing into me, I believe, I hope. Because he is TP and I do not. Yes, this wave is pushing into me. So it's really good for me to get my reset here instantly because this wave is pushing into me. And after it's crashing into my turret, it's going to bounce away from him. Can I play out the bounce with this HP? No, that is why I have to insta-recall. We're going to go for Ruby Crystal Refillable. Because we're probably going to be buying Bobby's in the first. And let's keep it going. Let's go. Already good, nice. Okay, so um, this is also a very important aspect, guys. You see how Kane's blue buff is still up, even though I had a ward here. So by process of elimination, we know that Kane is pathing to top because this blue buff is still up. If he started there, we would have seen it, right? And this blue buff would not be on the map anymore. So we know that Kane is somewhere around this area right now, 100% guaranteed. No. We can win the 2v2 though. Got level 4 here. Uh, let's back off. I want to just play with the wave. The reason I don't want to move here, chat, is because this wave is pushing away from me. So, regardless of the outcome, it's already a bad play for me to, to go for a scuttle like this. Because the wave is pushing away from me. So, if the play goes bad here, it's bad for me. But you see how this wave is slow pushing away from me? It's actually hard pushing away from me. Because these three casters remain and his three casters die. So, right now, I have three extra means on my me and wave. And that makes this wave push towards the, the clet right now. So, he likes going for this fight. I hate going for this fight. Because if the play would go wrong, I would lose the play, right? And lose my wave position. And if the play would go well, it'd be like even because the wave is still bad, but the play would go fine. But I don't want to take the risk here of having a double negative because it would instantly like close my game. So that's why I just have to push this wave here, but Shen's wave flight is so horrifically bad in the early game. Only once you have like Bami Cinder or Tiamat, you can start really clearing waves, right? But it was a good decision to push the wave. Does that make sense, Shet? That's why it's so important to always be aware of your wave states. And to make decisions around waves, not necessarily always around kills. I'm gonna freeze here. Uh, Kate is gonna go back into bot side. And how do I know that? And that is because he started his clear on bot side. Dragon Blade through him, E him here. So I know that this Kate is gonna go bot side right now. I'm not scared of Kane coming top side. Never here. Because I know he's guaranteed to go bot side here. It's five minutes, so the first plate security is dropped. I just summoned Ed Ed and Eddie and made Elio 011th. Got six towers and one V9 Ed the game for Plat 2 G. Real Avantin, well done. For the Thank guy. you for the tier one, bro. Amazing. Well done. And now this wave is gonna push back into me because he's gonna have extra means here. Kane is passing into top. I am not forced to walk up for last hits. Everything is good here. That's all fundamentals. GG. You want to learn all that? Type estimation of our course. It's all there, baby. All right, let's keep playing here. Okay. Hannah Monjana. 
I'm gonna E forward here so I'm a little bit faster so I can freeze this wave. This guy just hit level five, but I'm already five and a half, and I'm gonna get this entire wave. So we are super, super, super chilling. Gonna try and turn out the wave here. Get him off his horse. Gonna wait for his Q. Wait, I'm losing. I should have flashed auto at him. I would have won and I would have leveled up. I was too insecure. The means dealt most of the damage there, uh, unironically. That should be the kill chat. It's okay though. Clap players. Issue I have right now is I need to push out this wave and Kane is top side. So I'm gonna stand in the middle here so my Bobby Center hits everything. And yeah, I just have to try and push this wave as fast as humanly possible. But I'm a Shen. There is a fish as well. Oh, he's fuming. I have passive shoot as well. Oh, they 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 are mad, like ang like seething with rage actually. Ignite and ult. Clad is not even freezing the wave anymore. He's forgotten everything about the game. It's just like, you know what? I'm gonna push this wave now. I'm gonna buy Cleomat, so I just want pushing power. Clad had a perma freeze, but he's so upset, he's just gonna push. Let's go. Alright, Bolt is winning as well, because that's where Gragas is playing for. I could TP here. Well, try my best. How much you paid for them? Yeah, before heading into a solo queue game, I'm just like, okay, let me predict who's in enemy team and then just give him a, you know, quick paycheck. So I can get some validation in Platinum Elo. No, 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 it was his right play to push, actually. You are, you are right, uh, hello, one, two, three. what? My W was good, I blocked his attack so he doesn't get his horse, or what do you call it, wheelchair back. And now, I mean, we're in an amazing position. Okay, good. Told you, chat, you focus on fundamentals, your games are gonna go well. I just saw your Trundle plus Malphite outplay yesterday and laughed so hard. Good job. Trundle plus Malphite outplay? Oh, I don't remember. I don't remember now. Yeah, I'm Professor Akali. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Alright, gonna drag my bed through him. Drag my bed through him again. Get him off his horse. My blade is here, so if he walks up, I can drag it through him again. Gragushka is uh, angry. Roboruz. Oh. This guy is just having three better lanes. I don't have to sit through that. Now, the, the one issue I still have with Shen though is just, just farming. I even have two items that are supposed to give me wave clear. Alright, so we go. I'm not gonna lose anything. Buy this. Yeah, Kimi is good once again! Yeah, I didn't sort of kill this killer like 50 times, you piggy. Shut up. Can you oink for me? Minimal switch? Can you oink for me? You pig! Kidding. All fun and jokes. Soon I'll be cancelled as well, chat. Soon it'll be like headline Alois NL falls off. Prominent League of Legends streamer called his subscriber a pig. 
and has absolutely been cancelled. How could he? Get it, you're all pigs. Oink for me, piggy. Right, I got ult. We're still on platinum for some unknown reason. I have my ult. As long as you don't have a Google Doc made about your boss, man. Ah, oh, we're chilling, chat. Don't worry about it. Could be an exa- No, no, we're chilling, bro. Yo, Yasune, great, great to your food, bro. I've exact itself. To... Oh, I have ult here. No, don't stand still. Buffshun. Alright, not too shabby, not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. Buff my champion. Kidding, champion's weak. Alright, we go for CDR boots because we're snowballing out of control. We have 4 out of 5 ultimate hunter plus CDR boots. Now my ultimate is only 140 seconds cooldown. It's gonna be amazing. Aloy's owned by Twitch Lover. Aloy's, are you the Tiger Woods of League of Legends? No, bro, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just that random guy that talks about fundamentals. What did I used to do before I started streaming full time? I was a professional League of Legends player. Yep. Nice. Spammy Sinner got him off his horse. Okay, well, this game is going very smooth, but I told you guys I want to play a little bit better, and I am playing better, so that's good. I want to keep this up for the rest of the stream, though. Alois is Tim Duncan of League of Legends? That's a name I don't know though. Reported ah this fizz. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. You wanna report Fizz for his one death when you died. Clint died level two, level like level five, and like kept getting so looking. But Fizz died once. Ha 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 ha! Report it! Ha ha ha! Report Fizz, if only you knew! <laughs> Tim Duncan is the big fundamental in basketball? Ah. Why you left professional scene? Lots of reasons. I could take you- I, I could write a book about the things I saw in esports in two years playing there. But let's just say one big reason was religious reasons, another big reason was that I would rather live and die by my own sword than be reliant on my surrounding in every way, shape and form, and they See, see, the thing is, Chet, I think the professional scene, at least in ERL, you're gonna have very good teams, and you're just gonna have teams that are super unprofessional. There's a lot of scamming going on, a lot of teams don't play out their players, a lot of friend politics, and then... So, so I feel like the foundation of esports and teams, a lot, at least a lot of them, are, are, are pretty weak. And then you're left with teammates, and you get stereotypical to gamers, well, you, you can kind of see where that leads to. Um, there's just a lot of reasons for me to have quit professional play. Other than that, that, you know, I can, I can genuinely, I can, I can maybe make a video about it one day. Oh, I had ults, I should have ulted. Okay, let me focus. But yeah, I'm, um, let's get to you. Play League of Legendos. We're 9 and 0 Shen, but we can't full carry again. 200k special. I would be down to be pretty open about all my reasonings regarding leaving professional scene, but I, I have a pretty negative view on the professional scene in general, and that is... Um, yeah, that's just how I see it. That was my own personal experiences. I don't know how all the professional scenes are. There's so many stories about players and orcs getting scammed and stuff like this, I don't know. Carefully. 
This game is not won yet. My mid and jungle are not playing too well. I'm on the ward somewhere at least. I need to live, that's the most important part, I'm 9 and 0, right? I don't know where Fizz is at, that's my last threat. There he is, okay, we're chilling. You take out the arrow, if you take the hex gate over it? Really? I was actually thinking about it, but I didn't know if it would work like that. Fizz might come for me, but I think I can automatically outplay him. With flesh as well. Where's my sword? There it is. <laughs> Me and Ken just had a gentleman agreement to just take the wife and dip. Okay, I gotta focus because this game is not over by any means. If you subscribe my score, we're even. We're even a little bit behind. I'm really surprised with how behind my Hyber is, being 0-4, considering I killed Fizz, Tope, and he got like two waves, two plates. And uh, I, he burned Ignite and ult, but yeah. Chat. I don't want to be negative Nancy, there's a lot of positive things and being able to play League of Legends for a living was amazing But there's a lot of things that I didn't like about the professional scene and for me the lifestyle of a Of a streamer and YouTube content creation it, it I genuinely couldn't ask for any Bigger blessing so no, I, I really love this and I wouldn't change it for anything That sucks. Sun, I get it. Someone's cooking enemy team. I don't know, I, it's like, like I didn't even have to sidestep, they just, <laughs> it was like, beyond. Wait, when did I use the Herald? Did I even pick up the Herald chat? Wait, did I ever pick up the Herald? When did I use it? Am I Kluki? Did I ever pick up the Herald? I gotta focus, I gotta lock in. Let me lock in. despawned oh i never even saw that i would have yelled like a pig that's good i guess i preserved your guys's ears by, by simply not knowing wow okay i didn't see that <laughs> we're gonna play for nash soon all right we have soul point as well that's the one thing my genre has done well this guy's trying to be like me on yorick and he misses his e that's just special. Bro, like, oh my, like... Oh! I, I, I gotta make a rule, okay? Internal rule chat. My biggest advice as Shen players, do not ult when you know your teammate is a pig. If he is 0-4 Heimer into Fizz when he used everything, never ult these guys, because you're wasting it. And you lose all your tempo on the map. I saw him as that E. You know you shouldn't, you're not allowed to ult that guy. With well, that was beautiful, let's do Nash. We didn't even need anybody. That just went too easy. Heimer should TP top, but I think I'll have to walk. I don't want to give him a free tier 2 turret. My team can do Nash without me. You should never give a tier 2 like that. It's too much money. Maybe I should have preserved the plant. It's alright, I'll walk out like this. Graga saying that he needs the damage from me is kind of a capping too. We need 
Chen! We need Chen! I can stay top, by the way. I don't have to recall. Bro, the thing is, pigs are actually quite intelligent. So calling this hybrid a pig might be rude to piggies. Does that make sense? Should that call that guy a headless chicken? That's more accurate of a description. But they are smelly. Nothing wrong with that. Ooh. Oh. Do I ult on the pig? Do we do it, chat? Do we repeat the same mistake? Okay, I'm just, I just want to spite the cane. Mate? Yes, I am mad! Fuming, upset, raging, seething. This is not the first time that has happened, huh? It won't be the last either. It's okay, we accept it. We're 11 and 0 this game. We can be happy. Why are you staying? Why are you staying? Whatever, figure it out. Souls in 30 seconds. Pigs don't smell because they can't produce sweat. Pigs generally actually keep quite quiet. Pigs generally actually... Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sorry, bro. You, you can just say it if you want to be a pig, man. I don't know. They didn't even like fanboying pigs that hard. Chat. I watched me dodge skew. Mind control them by getting hit by the Q. That's what I meant. I can I can fight anybody. I'm not scared. I'm gonna fight. I don't think so, buddy. Auto. Auto. No, Q. Auto Hydro Cube. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's the one. Smack his ass just like that. Oh, we, we won't be like this game for sure. One of our better shine games finally, chat. Let's get more like that today. Let's get more games like this. This is also a pretty easy draft for me to play, though. Melee matchups feel way easier to play than ranged. I'm gonna recall I can just TP by ulting. Uh, well, should have ulted. I was uh, busy shopping. Uh, on all this, how big is my shoot? Holy moly! Is that two k? Oh no, it's no, it's like eight hundred base. And depending on, our, I didn't know the shoot was bigger depending on our missing health. I just read the two kit. Maybe I should have done that faster. I genuinely didn't know that my shoot increases based on our missing health. Well, you learn something new every day. I've learned today that pigs don't sweat. That, uh, no, I actually knew that already. And that the uh, Shen ult gives more shield depending on missing health. All right, 14 to zero. Finally, good game. Let's go. Play River Shen. What is River Shen? I know the meme, but like what, what defines River Shen? Is that just roaming? Like roaming the entire game or something? Reading is a skill. All right, Rosini. Rosini 2001. Elo check. Elo check. Send me no bridge. Piggy. Alright, this guy can get it. We'll play it. Alright, let's keep going. Oh, general Shen. Probably wrong with Shen Waterwalk. That sounds disgusting. I mean, today we are 4 wins, 1 loss, so decent. We're doing better. We're doing better with Sterox. Pigs can't anatomically look up. Alright. 
Oh, by the way, we were, were watching a video about why Gripex fell, fell off. What are, this guy's the homie, though. Wonder what he's doing right now in his life. Hey, that's what I played. If anybody flames my wallop, I'm permabending you. Yelp and I'll be Alois and Aloink. Sir, thank you for the primer. I remember Red Mercy. Shadow, that's completely up to you, bro. Like, it can be any champion, really. Who wants to swap? My homie. Let's go. Uh, I have a lot of first engage. Like, I can ult on Amumu, I can ult on Leona, I can ult on Samira. I like I like Shadow a lot with this stuff. I feel like in dive comps, Shadow just does so extremely well. Sayonus. There are so many good top players to pick it to Sion. We're playing Shen. Do I want to go TP? Like, I feel like I should go TP. Probably conditioning as well. Like, Ignite gives me kill pressure, but like, Sion players die anyways, and he is so much more wave player than me, so. I... Ignite TP. That's the one. But yeah, this is an Ignite TP type of game. Yep, 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 yep. We get best of both worlds. All right, let's go. <clears throat> All right. <clears throat> We're slowly whittling into Emerald and Mar. Okay. What playlist do we listen to? We'll just go with the old one. The old one. Right, let's go, Jet. Full focus against Sion. One of the most important things, Jet, is Sion is actually an extremely weak laner, right? Like, he gets countered by almost every top laner. And, but because of his passive, he's able to still gather a shit ton of resources. And the biggest job you have playing into Sion would be to not lose tempo. If he gets tempo, he can proxy and he'll never escape there. So never let him get tempo and you're good. Oh, maybe I should have went Doran's actually. Oh, sh okay, I could have went Doran's blade. Okay, well, it's fine. Your guys are too late. <clears throat> I want to know Briar's starting position. His name is Touch Me. He's got Corrupting Start Potion. Or potion Start. 
Dude, Shen's emotes are like so... Like, what does he do? Nothing. This is... Whatever, bro, bro can't even BM. This is like the highest BM level I can do. Do like a Gangnam style or something. Oh, what the... Hey, yo, yo! I'm in his head now, though, so that's good. Like, he lost that. He knows he lost there. Yes, we're playing E West. All right, I get my ward at level 1, just so I know where the Briar is starting. Chat, focus on Lufthansa Manners this game. Let's go! Level of timers, reset timers, wave manipulation, jungle tracking, all that good stuff. Five gold here for the ghost. I'm gonna put my Q down here. Remember, when you drag your blade through your opponent, you deal extra damage and extra attack speed. And my jungler is starting Raptors. He could do Raptors, Rep of Krugs, look to gank top. I want to look to fight level 1 by dragging my... Oh, I missed my dragging my blade. I missed my blade. I could have done a lot extra damage there. That's the difference. You see the attack speed difference? That's dragging your blade through your opponent against not dragging your blade through your opponent. Remember, you want to drag your blade through your opponent. It's behind them again. We're going to do the same thing. Dragging it through him. Boom. Look at that hit. Play for my level 2 now, chat. One caster and one melee. I, generally speaking, don't need this. Okay? I just need the melee. I'm going to walk backwards to kind of hide my intention here. And I want the sign to walk up for either of these last hits. And he didn't do it. Well played. He knew my level up timer. He's still on 0 CS. He's used two potions. Wow, I got all three of that. Even though I'm surprised. He gets level 2 from the mean dying. He didn't die yet, so he's still level 1, still with OCS. Amazing. Now he gets level 2, he wants to recall, but that is completely fine with me. Now him staying, the thing is, trading 1v1, 1 for 1 with the Scion, it's like, okay, but you gotta keep in mind that with his passive, he'll just farm the entire wave, right? So, it doesn't do that much good- Okay, gotta be careful. I'm just gonna prioritize again. I lost a lot of last, it's like 8 of them. But he's lost more. So you gotta keep in mind that trading with Scion, you gotta make sure that it's a, it's it's like an actual trade, and he has his passive, so you don't mind. His W is out. I'm gonna hit level 4 here. I'm gonna try and trade with him. Drag my blade through him. And I'm okay with this, because... Not for anything specific. Maybe I shouldn't. I don't know. Like I said, his passage gets the entire wave, but I'm gonna wall pack. I hope he TPs. Okay. All good though. Wave will bounce it to me nonetheless. We still have CS advantage. We don't get the first spot because there was always skirmish happening, but all in all. Okay, not the worst. This is really good because the bot lane wave pushes too much Samira, so this is extremely good for the bot lane. Dr. Master Wheat got outplayed by Autotex. Flash here. Okay, he's gotten a call. Science. Wait, why is he back already? Did he TP? He must have TP'd, no? But he did. He, no, he did die a little bit faster than me. Alright, uh, I'm not sure where Briar is at. I'm pretty sure Briar stops. I'm going to get my ward on here, as I assume she's here. I'm going to wait for him to Q and then E through him. Drag my blade. W for his auto attacks and chunk him to half HP. Waiting for my next Q. It's behind him now. And, oh, there she is, right? She pathed into top. That's why I knew I had to be a little bit wary of this guy's gank potential. I talked about it. That's why I got my ward done. I knew I had to realize fast. And now, how did I know Briar was topside? That's still because of the level 1 ward. Same reason is that I placed my ward down, but I never saw the blue ball disappear. That means she pathed to top, of course. 28 chest means she full cleared into top. She's gonna recall, go back into bot side. I don't have to be scared of Briar anymore. Joe tricking chat. Fire the manus. All right. Put my W down. I'm scared of the sign proxying. It's a little bit too late for that. Okay, Wave is in a good position. Some awkward last hit thing here. I hit my level 6 on next wave. Um, I have to slow push this wave chat because it just simply takes me too long to try and push this and then hard push and crash on next wave. So this is the wave I want to crash on. 
always try to figure out how you want to set up your reset so you can play in anticipation. If you're thinking at with wave stage, you're always prepared. Briar's piloting to top, we know that. Next wave is gonna walk through the lane so we can start pushing. You fake a finish action, you don't lose means. <laughs> That's a good message. I wanna get my Q off here. Very good trade. And now we reset TP back, and I, I like my position. I think I'm actually gonna go Tiamat. I know Petu told me that he doesn't really like rushing Tiamat, but I have a Ruby Crystal. I just follow Petu alone, stop being a pig. Okay, okay. I have TP. I also want some water. I'm out of water. That's a problem. Okay, just a little bit. I feel like Frodo in that one scene. If you know, you know. Alright, does this guy have TP? If not, he can base an old deck, but I get a freeze nonetheless, so I'm happy with my position here. <coughs> if anybody flames my wall up, I'm permanent. Yo, Sponge Abuser, thank you for the T1 one. Appreciate it. I could TP bot, but I want this fight without me. That's really good. He did never drag my bait through him. Auto. E through him. Auto, auto. Now I'm gonna drag my bait through him again. Again, three extra auto attacks with extra damage. And get the solo kill. Beautiful Q delay. So remember, chat. Drag your blade through your opponent. That's how you set up your kills. That's where all your damage comes from, right? So there, I drag my blade through my opponent. I slowed him. I did one auto attack. And I eat through him with two extra auto attacks on my Q. Then I step forward to drag my blade through him again. Get three empowered autos again. Six empowered auto attacks. Easy kill. Quay build, thank you for the prime, I appreciate it, brother. Now we want to set up our reset again. I'm gonna push the wave. I could reset here, right? Because the wave was pushing towards me, but look, I need 850 for my TMAT, and that is why I chose to push instead of recalling. I'll set my ward here. Bro, this estimation mark date emote, who made this? Without a sound. <laughs> Whatever. All good. Alright, chat, we're in an amazing position. This guy is going 80 Cyan, so we're fine. The reason I put this ward here so that after he pushes the wave, I will see what he's gonna do. What is a rip delay? I don't even know. It should be Q delay. Or like kill delay. I don't even know, bro. Whatever. We have a freeze here. He cannot get any plates. We never gave him enough tempo, so we're always in a good position. Try to get the blade through him. Beautiful. That's one ultimate hunter stack. Oh, because Leona lands, yeah, I get another ultimate hunter stack. And I need 150 gold, so I'm gonna stay here for a second. I need a bit of extra money. Is this sign ult coming here? Got my item. We're getting some good games in finally. As long as we climb out of this MMR, like I feel like the higher we get, the, the easier this climb is gonna be. Contrast to other champions, which is, which is a little bit funny. 
What's that guy doing? What do you think about top play shake players? I mean, they're like masochist, but like to the extreme. Because you play shake up. You play shake up top, which you shouldn't do. And then. Well, you, so you play top lane. It's like suffering by default. And then you play shake up top. It's like, hmm, what are you trying to achieve? You go on a second day to find out? Alright, Lotus. Send me, uh, you just pass me the, the number of your mom. No, I'm kidding, bro. I should stop making this joke. Mom jokes are really outdated and are boring. Kidding. Goodbye, piggy. Please kill him with Ignite. 20 HP. Your mom is fat. You make LOL a really entertaining game to watch. Yo, Sponge Abuser, that's a really nice compliment to receive. Thank you so much, man. Alright, so we, got, we get CDR boots because I just want to be able to make more plays on the map, get my TP more often, get my ultimate more often. I can skirmish more with the CDR boots, I just think it's way better. Alright, let's go. If I can make tank gameplay entertaining, and I feel like we're doing a good job. How should you so Alois? Fine, as long as I have ornamentals. <laughs> Alright. Plus five gold for me. Yeah, true. If I had Dorn's blood, I would kill him. That is actually true. I'm just gonna spite the side. Like, this guy's so upset with me ulting here. I'm gonna wait for skew. <laughs> that guy's mad, like angry, seething. Remains funny to tilt people with the Shen ult. Two and a half minutes is not that bad of a cooldown. On a rank one ultimate. Now I have rank two, so now it's gonna be two minutes. Chill. In a plate here. And now we're gonna go for plates here. Efficiency. I gotta slow push just a little bit, chat, because look where next wave is at. Next wave is here, I wanna let that wave walk through the wave and then push it, so... Crash is in one go. You guys like, oh, which card do I take? Which card... Idiot. Twisted Fate players, it's like... Jerry speaking, Twisted Fate players, Vayne uh, players, you don't have mercy with them, because... They have made so many people feel dreadful already. So just do whatever you- Oh, this guy's Eclipse. He can kill me, but I want to fight him. I want to limit test. I want to limit test. This game is kind of over. Wait, that's a lot of shoots. Okay, I'm not going to limit test. I'm sorry, bro. I'm going to hear TFT. Not that good, honestly. I've only played one set of TFT. It was like with the Void set. And all I did was play Void and one-check Void. Even though I couldn't get Void things at the start. I didn't really know how it worked. Like gold dealer or something. I didn't play much TFT. Uh, if I play a game, I want to know everything about it. And like TFT has its own learning curve. And I don't have the time or the spare time to invest all the time in learning how to play TFT. And so I don't play it. Does that make sense? Plus 300 still? Can I mean? <laughs> Is it up tempo? No. Don't know what it means, so I, I would just say no. Since we've been going static second, I have noticed a significant increase in my win rate though. Just watch KG Sojo and you will be good. I watched them a little bit. But the thing is, like when I was watching TFT videos, they were doing so many concepts that I'm like not familiar with. Like these guys who just continuously buy units, sell them again, and, like hold them, and then they randomly upgrade things that are completely not on that. Like I, I don't know, bro. I couldn't understand how TFT works. It has such a learning curve. I, I CBA'd. 
They would like buy units that like didn't even fit in their comp and they would like get rid of it again because it like gives them a mid game spike or whatever and they, they know like all the items and like where to place what they know everything I don't so I just didn't I, I just CBA for that game at all. Got your homie, got your homie, got your boss man, got your boss man, got your boss man. Hey, W, hey, hey. Just a fade. I got that W for you. Little piggies. Sorry. Clean though. Clean though. I'm running Ultimate Hunter every game. Petu told me to go Ultimate Hunter, not not uh, the other build. Dude, this song legit sounds like it says fundamentals. Why is the piggy barking? It might be acoustic. Bro, who said I'm the piggy? When I say piggy, I mean you guys. You guys should know that. You guys should know that by now. Can you even lose? Well, we were losing... Like yesterday, I had five wins, four losses, which is the worst I've ever started. How do you counter proxying in general? You never give them the tempo to start proxying. That's how you counter proxy. Or that's how I explained it as well. You need to never give them tempo. Do you know Dimitri K? No, I don't really know this. I'm sorry, bro. All right. Hey. Stop that. No. No. Hey, come back. You. Piggy. Oh, okay, well. Wow, that's pretty smart. Just pops down the herald. He's like, you know what? I'm out, bro. I respect it. Gotta utilize that more myself. Free escape route. Well played, Valkos, bro. Why is this guy, like, talking to himself? This guy definitely has voices. I didn't block it. I have Sterok chat. They think they're winning. They don't know me, son. Look at that shield, baby. They don't know me. They don't know about the Sterox. They don't know about the Sterox! They never expect it! Ah! Stare action! Ow! Well, okay. He was 0 11. This guy was 2 and 5. This guy was 2 and 4. Hey! He killed him. How do I hit this minion? I can't. Uh oh, we have a problem, chat. Do we though? Yeah, we definitely do. Somebody save me! Oh! Wait, Sterex broke again! It just came off cooldown! Oh! 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 Not very close. We have 12 kills again! Such a high kill Shen game. Once the champion starts rolling though, you become him. Enemy team is also straight running it though. Wait, who is he? Oh. Samira gave him a response. Oh. Level up, level up, level. That's why I win. MB. For you, what's the highest rank a normal player can get playing Arena Solo Queue? For you, what's the highest rank a normal player can get What? I don't understand your question. You can get any rank playing Aurelia. In fact, Aurelia is one of the highest win rates she's ever had. She was like 52% win rate in high elo, which is unheard of. So, yeah, you can definitely climb on Aurelia if you want to. 
All right, chat. We're gonna go the item that somebody told me about as well. So I go. This was some hidden strategy, so we're gonna try it. <gasps> The attack speed is nice. Tread carefully. Q delay. I have three Q stacks. Delaying my Q right here. Come on, walk here. That's one piggy down. That's not even remotely close, Alois. I'm sorry. Can this guy like stop scratching my balls? There's someone there. No? He's here. Could have altered. Would be a waste. I want to terminus finish this game. Shit. We are in trouble, chat. <coughs> See the arbors though. We baited them. I have my job is done, chat. My job is done. Samira can take over the rest. Hey, that's on me. Is your change done? Yes, sir. Chat at the end of the stream. I also have a. Um... I'll also have a nice message to share with the bros. Right. We couldn't finish the terminus. How? This looks like a TFT build now, with the recurve bows. Wait, we might be able to finish the terminus. No, game's over. What are you doing? Or right, is the only way I don't get to the family picture? You love us? That speaks for itself. I'm getting hungry. I'll get my food soon. Is it Alois OnlyFans? Bro, the day I have an OnlyFans, you can just line me up at the wall and. Um... No, I'll keep... no, I'll. It won't happen. Don't worry, bros. Stop asking, too. Why, why, is, that, why is that that your mind turns to, by the way? You know. Go away, uh, go, go, go in the search. Um, yeah, I'm not sure, Felix. All the votes are on YouTube, but I uh, probably don't have them all on Patreon yet. I'm getting hungry. I got my food soon. Okay, we keep watching why Gripex fell off. This guy was the goat, though. I said this before. I'm not watching this because I'm happy of his downfall. Don't get my intentions wrong. I, I'm genuinely curious what happened to Gripex. And also because I can kind of learn from it. Angering.
Really, Felix? Yeah, I guess most of the Trundle content hasn't been saved. Maybe we should just redo Trundle. I could redo Trundle, I guess. Because it was really towards the end of December. Primordial Crab, thank you for the Primer, bro. What do you think about climbing with Olaf? Very stable, it's a good champion. He wins 80% of his matchups in the early game, maybe 90%. I, I think he's a very stable champion to climb with consistently. So yeah, I, I like stable consistently, same thing, but yeah, you get the point. He looks so clean here. Can't wait to watch this video about here in 10 years. Such. True though. That's such. Well, let's see. I don't know what type of lifespan a a content creator has. This is interesting to see. Because like, Gripax was such a big creator. I really, this guy had like, so many views. But ultimately, at the end of the day, he's not streaming anymore, right? So that's always a question in, at the back of my mind. How long does a career like this really last? It's always interesting. I think he's a dad now, by the way. You think in 10 years he's really going to be streaming when he's 43? Is Gripex 43? Are you talking about me? Piss off! Big booty hippo, you're the dusk to my blade, the steel to my heart, and the gore to my drinker. Will you marry me? Sure, bro. Why the hell not? All right, Olaf. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go ahead and match this Olaf early game strength by maybe going D blade. What are we thinking, Jet? Are we cooking? I'm gonna go D blade. I'm gonna keep the attack speed though. All right, let's focus. We're still in platinum elo, bro. This is this climb is gonna take like 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 a century. It is what it is. At the loss now. Fun fact: Did you know you had a Rivet OTP account in Challenger? What do you mean? All right, chat. You know what we're gonna do. What do we do with Shadow's Bend? I want to try the Drain Tech Volgar build. That thing looks broken. Alright chat, you know what line to say. Well, I don't even remember the line. It's something with Untersheet. Doran's Untersheet Kling- Doran's Klingon! That's the one. Nah, a Shen Tree. That's what happens when you go 5 and 4, I guess. But yeah, we were stuck. But today's going good. Today we only have one loss, five wins, I think. So pretty good, pretty good thus far. The music is very loud. Yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. There you go, fix it, bros. Chat, let's focus on Final Manus as per usual. This guy's playing Inspiration Conqueror, and Olaf is one of the best jet checkers in the game because of his passive, right? His passive gives him massive attack speed, 
But what's very important to the game like this is level up timers, tracking the jump. He's one potion. There is no I want to mentally torture him before going into the lane. All right, let's place an aggressive Q. Okay. I want to look for priority, even though Sh Olaf is one of the strongest level 1 champions, Shen is as well. I'll show you guys this game. Is d 2? Does he know that I've went for D-Blade, Flash Ignite myself, and a super aggressive setup? He looks to be playing a little bit safe. He doesn't win. Dorad's clean! Hunters! Where'd he go? I didn't even play that clean. I think the way he's pushing it to me. I, I, it's too hard to know. I don't think it is. No, it's not. Is it? It's so hard to see. If it is, I can recall. I'm only on the last latest frames. No, it's pushing it to him. That's like even. I'm gonna recall. I have to recall. Ah, oh, my genre is coming topside. I, I need, I need, I need, I need a gank. I need a gank. I need a gank. D blade is sustaining. He's gonna kill the cannon, so he's not gonna have any pressure to all in me. Okay, good. Just hope no Zek ganks are chilling. Press on. Okay, with lasting perfectly like that, I get my Bami Cinder. And he's gonna freeze. DJ Johnny Luarca. Are you a pig or are you a swine? Or both. Okay, I cancel my auto twice. Amazing. It's fine, chat, because I'm dying on my turn, okay? I'm dying on my turn, so I actually don't lose much. And they share the EXP, and Zek got the kill. Unironically, it is not bad what happened here. It sucks that I die, but I might even be in time to get a freeze here, and then it doesn't matter at all. And even if he gets this wave in, I lose nothing. Look, he's still level 3, right? And they shared the XP, and like, you can say, oh, Copium, Copium, it's... I'll show you guys what I mean, though, but you guys don't have enough fundamentals to, to like, understand, and like, pr 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 like, 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 seeing in the future, and like, seeing that I get a freeze here, and I, like, eh, they think streamer is griefing, but like, look, chat. Dying can be good. Dying can be good. Who would have thought chat? Okay, shit, he's Olaf. <laughs> Flame streamer, see what happens. You now I'm gonna thin out the wave, get my reset in, and uh, yeah, we're chilling. Did I tell you it was a good death? Yeah, she just didn't listen. Yeah, she just didn't know to listen. Drag this to here, and then we're gonna recall, and it sets a little bit more to the center, and boom, bamba. Fundamentals, first time message, no! There you go, chat. Any more comments? Any more piggies that I, I wanna leave their comments here? If dying is good, why don't you make him die? Because he died whilst I had a freeze, you. It's about the timer of dying. Okay, it's about the time it'll die. With balanced steps. I mean, this guy is smoking crack cocaine or something. Like he's saying, like level of times or something. Like, no, that's crack cocaine right there. That is not a good. Uh, did you just say your mom? He certainly did. Our will You're asking that, bro. Oh, never mind. He made the wave slow push towards him, chat. There you go. Find a manners. I didn't have to ignite. That's my bad.
Is he AFK? Has he had enough? See? Fundamentals! Made him AFK! Oh. Joueur de Draven. Joueur, you're piss off. I'm not sure about this fight, boss man. Doesn't really work against him. Um, uh, my W could have been infinitely better. I hit a minion! Zek is out of mana. We can win. Holy shit, my W was bad. Holy shit, my flesh was bad. He just hit level 6, by the way. If I W, can... Well, that guy's, like, worse than I am. So it's, like, fine. That guy sucks. Push, 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 push. Fatty, 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 fatty. Help me push. Is that kind of mana? Huh? It was a joke, chat. It was a joke. Huh? Is that kind of mana? Is this streamer psychotic? I'm down to fight. Oh! Oh! Nicht gut. I could ult here. Wee! <laughs> my, my, my. Give me that shit. I give him the cannon before he flashes again. He just flashed like that. Damn, damn, damn. He just flashed like that. Damn. Try to save you, bro. You know you're winning. They know your game like that, man. I'm B, like. Sorry. Maybe I should have TP bot, huh? Yeah, the TP here would be better. He was not happy with me taking that kill. Got six kills again, man. What a game. I have 6 out of 8 kills though, that's just not that good. You guys know who a good coach is? Alois. That guy is good. That's no way. Yin Yang Sin, take it to one. Appreciate it. Drag blade through him. Duran's blade. Bomba. Wait, we'll push back into me. We're chilling. I'm actually gonna push. Please, no, Zach. Easy. Really easy. Boomy diff, boomy diff. You've been watching Avatar a little bit too much, that primordial crap. Oh, wait. Oh, I don't have ult. I'm like spamming ult. I'm like, why is it not going? Am I like, lag? No, I don't have it. Alright, well, that answers it. <clears throat> this is deserved. He is playing Olaf. Not wrong. Not wrong at all. Uh, we have 7 out of 9 kills. That could be an issue. Especially with Kaiser being 4 and 0. Yeah. Ooh, Mr. Johnny Boy. If I drag my blade through him there, he was dead again. Lily, I need this kill.
Yeah, I mean, I want to give it to him, but like, you gotta light your shit, bro. He's talking about my mom again. You don't mind, Lily? I'm gonna take the turret. What do you need help with? Like, sure, you're a grown woman, no? I'm taking like 800 gold here. I don't care about those three grubs. Everybody needs assistance. Okay. Oh, Bomba! Oh, right. eat him out of his thing. Immediately. Well, I eat again. I did the same mistake. I wanted to go for it. There we go. She ulted in. That's my Q. Ah. At least I bought CDR shoes before that. So I... <clears throat> hey, there's Felix, look. Where's this guy, saw? I'll find her. Maintenance man! Maintenance man! Jinx, you take it. There you go, baby. Creating some weak conditions here on the bot side of the game chat. Say thank you! Oh. She said thank you just before that. Because I lose my food turret, so I needed her to say thank you. You know, just just for reference. Sucks. Any advice for a new Shen player? Stick to one room page. Learn to play with Ignite. And utilize your early game aggression. Or like your early game strength. You are so strong in the early game. My entire team is inting, man. Chill! It's always getting the most free game ever. The strongest level 1 top lane champion is Trundle. Trundle, Darius and Warwick, those three are the strongest. They can 2v1 enemy top jungle very often. Any advice for a new Malphite player? I don't know, like... Press Q and E and W. Like, spam control 2. Spam control 2 when you're playing Marvel Fight. Trust me, it will help you increase your win rate. By at least like 5%. If you spam it enough. The win rate today is like really good, like... We don't talk about it. He did, Lilia doesn't even have ult, by the way. Just, just to add that extra spark of... Walk in! Why do people always walk away? I need them to go in. Nice. This guy's no flash. Wow, my Q got he got cancelled like that. I 
I'm just gonna give money to my Jinx. She gets two kills again, so I'm making a wing condition. Will Olaf do something low? It's working, chat. It's working. We're tilting them. I got so much for my Jinx now. Two kills again and the turret. Four out of five stacks. If this guy W's me, I will kill him. Wait, she still is old. Well, I'm the sneakiest ninja you guys have ever seen. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Told you, baby. Told you, baby. Told you, baby. <laughs> Gonna reset the side wave. Not too wide, though. Brown can get it. Brom can get it, baby. That's all you, Brom. That's all you, baby. So, chat, do we try the Terminus? Do we try it? Do I try the Terminus? Type what a chat if I shoot. Oh, don't tell me. This is real. This Olaf kills the Jinx that I just gave a shutdown and gets a full tier 2. I don't know, I don't have a team. I don't have a team. Oh, this Olaf is pretty good at the game, I think. Oh, oh well, everybody said one, so we're going to Terminus. Let's try it. You die, Shen, for the tower, I full ping. If that guy starts flaming me when he makes that decision, I hope you. Your, I hope one pea or one piece of potato in his food today is like cold when it's supposed to be warm. That's what I hope for that guy. I have ult, keep fighting. This guy has two and a half items now. It weren't even. I'm even with Olaf now. That's not tilting at all. Giving them kills again. That's my fault again. Well, my teammates are getting kills. Olaf is getting turrets again. Not sure if we can do Baron. I'm really not sure about this one. If Olaf dies or kills my Gragas, I'll be severely upset. Coke Skittles, am I right? I have candy from this game. Thank you for the prime. This Olaf is getting, it's just getting everything. Like, my team is doing everything they're not supposed to do. It's just it's surreal, by the way. Genuinely surreal. Oh. You kill him. These are one of those most frustrating games, right? If I win this game, it's like, I've done everything in my 
like imaginable but this olaf is probably even ahead of me now because he again got a turret he killed the Ol olaf or the gragas he almost got the tier 2 bot as well like this olaf is just getting everything because of the misplays of my team and it's really really sad but at least he has gold now and jinx has gold so i have followed gold to two of my carries at least so maybe the game is winnable but they still need to play well and they have shown the whole game that they can't really so let's see He's almost three items. I almost got this, though. Well, you get everything because of the misplaced of the enemy team, no. I have only forced place. So I solo killed this all of, like, five times. And then I've been roaming the map constantly, not really giving them an opportunity to play the game. Olaf is just running side lane and getting random kills. It's something completely different. I'm setting up a play. Olaf just runs side lane and gets multiple kills and turrets because my teammates just run it down. I don't know, that Lilia ulti here kind of just summarizes everything for me. At least he flushed. Why is Melee a bot? Sure. Terminus, baby. Steve, I should be good because Kai'Sa already can't fight. I need to get a reset for my Jinx. Wait, this Terminus damage is crazy, though. I'm blocking everything. Olaf killed my Gragas. There's a random Lilio. I don't know where he was the whole fight, but hey, welcome, bro. Zack is surprised by the Shen Terminus. Well, we gave everything to the Jinx. I got zero gold from that, but we're doing my job the whole time. We secured that fight. Let's go. Terminus, man. Oh, that's some healing. Shouldn't fight like that. Not sure about the Gragas flank here. Do Gragas and Lilia know how, how, how all of old works, or are they like genuinely this clueless? Just, just, just you know, ask, asking for a, for a friend. I'm not sure. Well, Jinx is three items. Remember that Kai'Sa had these two items and my Jinx had like a little bit like I've shut down this Kai'Sa so hard We killed it three times in total now and my Lilia is strong too. So like we can actually win this game now I have been expanding my exp expanding my lead amazing as a, as a tank, right? This guy's no passive Oh, come on, Jinx, it's a reset. Nice. Nice. Zack flashed. You can do Nash now. All of this is alive. I can ult on them. I'm gonna go bot. This all of his only split pressure, but look, he's three and a half items, and he's getting another tier two turn. This guy's gonna be four items, just like me. I need empty heal, maybe. Man, am I doing a lot in these team fights though? Okay, got a flush. Nice. I knew we would out damage him there with my Jinx. I just gotta create space. Or just or just or just kill him. 
Creating space again. I'm dead this time, though. Jinx. Ah, that's not enough. Okay. I went a little too deep as well. I need to play well now, though. Ooh, the E saved her from the Zack. Nice. Hi, what stuff do you recommend doing with Shen against Cassio Top? Ooh, that's a really hard matchup. Is Cassio Top or other... You need to rush Titanic Hydra. That's a really hard matchup, yeah. Oh yeah, I, will, I don't want to find myself in that matchup now that you guys are mentioning a matchup like that. That would be disgusting. I might want this item, actually. What are we doing here? My Jinx almost four items now. <clears throat> I hope you guys learned something from how I expanded my lead from top lane though, even though the Olaf is very strong in the game now. Like, I, as, a, as a tank, it's not my job to full carry the game. I know I'm bad zero for David Prime or, or for tier 1 rather. But yeah, I've been expanding my lead through this Jinx the whole game, right? So I hope you guys took away some stuff from that, because in my opinion, this has been one, like an extremely educational game. Probably the most educational game on Shen thus far. Because everybody was like playing bad, but I have created win conditions with my lead. This guy's not flash. I'm gonna defend top actually against the Olaf. If I had ult, I'd use it here, but I can't. Try this in one minute. Jinx reset. Pop off, baby. Pop off, baby. I didn't have Titanic, I didn't have Titanic. Watch this though, watch this, watch this. Through the brum. No, 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 no. I have no energy! Eh! Okay, I had no energy. I had my E earlier, my E would have landed, but when I E, I didn't have energy and I spam clicked it and then my E would land. Oh no. Oh, what? No, the, ray, the way that Olaf ult works is Olaf ult la lasts infinitely as long as he is auto-attacking or landing E. If he lands E or auto-attacks, the duration of his ult basically continues. Yeah, Lily has late game now and Jinx is full build. Jinx gets a reset. Ooh, that blue trinket. He spotted the little piggies. Why aren't you playing Sunfire? Every Shen player tells me that Sunfire is horrible. EV with ADT1, thank you for four months. Hello Alois, how are you boss? I was Camille main and because of the new season I am playing mages mid like HWEI and Velkos. What do you think about that? I can't see it. Camille kind of suffered from the changes in terrain and stuff like that, right? And like the removal of the vine has also been pretty like lost for her in some of the harder bruiser matchups. So I, I, can, I can understand it. Yeah. Hope you're having fun in mid lane. Be a mid lane piggy. I have ult, so I'm waiting for that kind of. You shouldn't overstay though. Should back off probably. What is wave? Nice. They should bring Sunderer back. Can somebody ban Rhythm like real quick? That's like, that's like forbidden to say, bro. It's like flaming my family tree, even suggesting that, bro. Oh, 
Oh. What is Grago doing? Third one kill participation, not too shabby, but it's yours truly. I love you, Shen Moama. Sorry, I had to do if it. If anybody flames my wallop, I'm Only Twitch that can say that. Thank you, brothers, for the primer. Underscore NL cheers, enjoying your content, smiley face. Any plans to do a mid to challenger series? Yes, I will eventually. Would be interesting to watch I play both lanes with a passion laughing face. Yes, I will be switching over to other roles. It's it's work in progress, but I'm not sure when yet. I'm not sure when, when we yet. Get off meta top to master. Thank you for the prime as well. The top run. I could do an off meta champion to top lane, yes. I could. I'm considering it. I am... Th th there's so many plans. Okay, chat. What how about a one... I'll run you guys through all the plans that I currently have. Thank you for both primers, chat. I, uh, I appreciate it a lot. I hope you guys enjoyed this game. It was a very uh, educational game, if I do say so myself. Bearded Donkey and Prandus, thank you for the primer. Okay, I'll run you guys through some of the plans that I have, okay? There, there's a lot of different content at this that I want to do. Yo, Rangers. Good to see you, brother. So... First things first, right, is what kind of content do I want to do in general? I'll give this, I'll give it to, to this guy. Um, give me a second. I'll, I'll run down all of the thoughts that I currently have. Um, good damage, good gold earned. Voice. My Jinx ended up playing well, and uh, that's good. Um... Okay, so the content ideas that I have. So right now, the way that my con tonight I'll also be uh, is the first upload of a new type yeah, of no idea that I want to do. Z noobs, I think the prime. So, um, basically, right now I stream, right, and from that streamed content we make our videos on YouTube, and then also from the content from Twitch. Who added me? Was it the Jinx? That's my boy Orana. All right, uh, and then also from the content from Twitch we make YouTube shorts and. Uh, TikTok and stuff like that, right? So basically, all the content is mainly my streaming content. Now, I want to switch that to more active YouTube content. So instead of mainly streaming, I also want to make, call it exclusive, basically without streaming, uh, off streaming, recording, I want to make more YouTube videos. So I want to do multiple different series. One idea I had is I want to make it more interactive for everybody um, and have it educational and entertaining and repeatable. Those were kind of my ideas. So I want it to be repeatable, entertaining, educational and interactive if possible. So the first serious idea that I have is you guys can send me your votes and you're still able to do that right now. In the Discord, there's a channel that's called Votes. You can send me your votes. You give me a um, rundown of what the game was and then I will be uh, selecting votes that I want to review. And... Um, no, thanks, bro. And uh, so uh, that, that is one idea. And then it'll be like educational, right? Because I'm teaching you guys. It'll be entertaining to see what other people do, what other people, uh, what mistakes they make, what kind of um, things they do. I haven't figured a name for the series yet, but that's one idea that I have right now that I'm working on tonight. We upload the first YouTube video. So if you want to check it out, type exclamation mark YouTube, it'll be there. I'm going to be reviewing an iron game, which I thought was very interesting. To just see the, the, the simplest amount of mistakes being made building up leading into a loss. Even though the Chogit was 11 and 0, he lost the game, which is very interesting. Uh, and I can also do different roles. Now, I have a second idea, right? So the main chan or content that I'm doing right now is the Unranked to Master series. And I want to do that on every champion. However, I require to play around 80 games per champion to reach to Master's ELO. I'm doing this to help out every top laner. And also to showcase that the fundamentals that I use for Riven or just playing in general are applicable to every champion. And of course, every champion has their own strengths, their own weaknesses. And I try to highlight that with the series. Um, so that's my idea with that, right? And also any top player, be it an Aatrox player, be it a Shen player, be it a Clip player, be it a Riven player, can see my content and be like, okay, I can learn something from that, right? That's another idea. So I also have a broader audience instead of just being a Riven player. 
However, one issue that I have is usually when I start unranked, you start in like platinum MMR. So a second content I did that I have, which would be um, a series, which again, I tried to make it engaging, entertaining, and repeatable, is going to be playing in the lower MMR. So let's say bronze to platinum. It would be off stream, but I would basically make it how to escape X elo and go extremely in depth, similar to how I do with other masters, but I'm not streaming, so I'm, I'll be super focused on no chat interaction, only that, just pure educating to like the most simple score how I can do. So basically, on every champion, but it'll be way shorter, right? It'll be like a one-hour video how to climb on this champion out of lower armor. That is an idea that I have, and then I have some other ideas like should you play X champion or something like this. So right now, all our content is centered around top lane, but. For the foreseeable future, I also want to start doing other roles and playing uh, other roles. How I want to fill that in is still up in the air. Um, of course, just playing mid lane, playing jungle, playing AD carry, playing maybe support as well is interesting, right? And I definitely want to do that. Uh, but I'm not sure how I would shape the content. Would I do unranked to masters on one champion? Would I just play every champion in jungle? How do I want to make it educational? Because I first have to learn those roles as well, right? I don't know everything about that. So there's a lot of things to think about there. But those are kind of my ideas right now going forward. And um, I, I am also looking forward to feedback on tonight's video. So if anything, I would highly uh, appreciate if you guys can just, you know, check out the YouTube channel, watch tonight's video, give me your feedback on that. Next week, thank you for the T1, man. What am I even laning against? Mordekaiser, I assume. So what's this? It's a very tricky matchup into Mordekaiser. I want to buy QSS, but QSS is so extremely inefficient here because they have four AD champions, and you can't build QSS into anything, but I need it here. Bro, I won't get an OnlyFans. Not now, not ever. If, like I said earlier, get an OnlyFans, line me up against the wall, pull the trigger in game. Kidding, bro. I won't ever do an OnlyFans chat. I got food, though. I got my chicken rice broccoli. Chicken rice broccoli. My homie brought me food. That's why I said thank you, bro. Really. All right. Amazing. Now I won't starve. Block the term only fans. I like that failing. I like that. So, those are the content ideas that I have. Give away your courses. The other day we did a giveaway. I can do more giveaways. Either coaching or or courses or stuff like this. I'm definitely... Um, I should consider giving away more in general. I uh, have a very privileged position. So I do want to do more giveaways, but I'm not sure how to, how to set it up. But yes, I can do more giveaways. Be it RP, be it courses, be it... I don't know, whatever. So I, yeah, I want to do something like that more too, for sure. Um, cool and bad, one, two, three. What I would recommend for every, anybody to, like, learn how to use runes, I, I would definitely read all the runes and, like, see what all the runes do, but the, the, here is one of the biggest tips I can give you or advices. There's two sites that I would use to search runes. So I showed you this before, right? Diplo. I'm sponsored by Diplo, by the way, but I, I genuinely use it for this. So let's say I wanted to play Shen, right? If I wanted to learn how to play Shen, I would go here, I would go to OTPs, and I can just find an OP, OP.GG of an OTP. And this is from EOS, Servicta. And boom, we can check his match, uh, we can check his matches through, we can see what runes he takes, we can see what builds he takes. Shen players will have different play styles. Now, if you want to filter more matches specific, I go to a different side, because this is just his random matches theory, right? So he's like playing against Zack here, playing against Karma here. But let's say you wanted to see how Shen players would b build against Jack. So here I would type Shen. This is called low VVV. You go to top lane, you filter your matchup here, you go to Jax, that's the one we wanted to see. And there you see two matchups here being played. I mean, some top laners you don't really know. Shen isn't very often picked, right? Uh, but here you can see the setup, you can see the build, all that stuff, right? So uh, you can do that for every champ. Let's say you wanted to learn Fiora. You're like, okay, I want to learn Fiora, Doris matchup. You can see pro players and what they take, and then you can kind of study it that way as well. So those would be the two advice that I have. Link to that site. Here is the low VVV. There you go. This is the low VVV site. Those are the two sites that I use to scout my runes. All right, I can't really want to eat because else I have no, uh, no triumph. I need some water, so I need to get up. Hey, 
Anytime, bros. Anytime. <laughs> Website under <she. laughs> Right, better backtrack for a second. I'm gonna already switch the scene to in-game. I'm gonna grab some water. I have to climb through the hole in my wall. So I turn on my camera just because it's a little bit weird. And I am better back in a second and let's have a good game. All right, I'll run TP because I play a ranged matchup. I can't control the wave, so I wanna go TP. Yeah, wait, one second. Alright bros, we're back. It's crazy to me how we're still in this MMR. We play against one of the piggiest of piggiest of piggiest playstyle, which is Twisted Fate Top. If you play this... I won't say. Yeah. I said this before, if you play Twisted Fate and Vayne Top, it's like... Flexing as an OnlyFans model that you are rich. Did you really earn your money? Did you really earn your LP? That's what it looks like, okay? He's playing Fleet, Sorcery, Flash Ghost, he can never die, wins 1v1, wins sideline. I hate it. But, but, we're gonna try and cheese him. I am so sleepy. Yo, Gara, you're tier 1, bro. Let's go. All right. Most and least difficult champions to go against the champ. I hate range matchups. I hate range matchups with a passion. <sighs> Make me not sleepy, Gara. Okay. Chat lads. Yo, wake up, Gara! Wake up! Hope you woke up, bro. I shouldn't scream too loud because my family thinks I'm being like taken hostage or something. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. How will Twisted Fate path? Here or here? I'm guessing here. I'm hoping here. I'm hoping here. Sorry, chat. We had to wake Gara up. It was a team effort. Okay, maybe he'll walk here. Ah, oh, whatever. There is no dispute. Want to try and push here? Chat, always do this, okay? If a ranged top laner allows you to push in the early game, do it. Because if you get priority, you can get your level up timers first. And then they have to focus on last hits instead of being able to push and harass you. Hello, Tyrus, baby! Yeah! 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 
Level of timers! Yeah, Twisted Fate players don't know about level of timers because they're too busy trying to see uh, what socks they should sleep with tonight. Yeah, they sleep with socks on. Oh, that one hurt. Alright, use your W for fun, so I won't E onto you. Nice one, buddy. The way he's pushing into me, he has no HP left. I keep pushing the wave, see what happens. It's really smart, bro. Do it, do it, do it. Do it, do it, do it. Do it, do it. No, keep pushing, keep pushing. See what happens, Twisted Fate. Keep pushing, bro. Why are you pushing into me? So that's very good. Let's cancel his recall once. Ooh. Even if Leah is here, I don't care. One for one is fine. The smartest Twisted Fate top player. Let's go. Oh, 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 winning against a Twisted Fate top is like... Oh, yeah. You don't go Tabis. Or sorry, um... Titan... Bobby Cinder against Twisted Fate, so we're gonna go for uh, Titanic. Sorry, I couldn't figure out what I wanted to say. Apologies. We can gank here. And ping that he has no flesh, no ghost. So, free. Wave is good. Jarvan, please open your eyes. Stop doing the scuttle. Like, please stop doing scuttle and come before he pushes in the wave. Please, surely you see this, Jarvan. Like, please. Thank you. You can take the kill even. Thank you. Kudos to you. So you see here, chat. See here, chat. That by doing a early trades, because I was pushing in the early game, right? And I got my level 2. That level 2 trade that I did on the Twisted Fate instantly ruined his game. And then he also started pushing the wave into me. And I instantly told you guys, this is going to be his death sentence. Because losing all your HP and potion, and then also pushing the wave to your opponent... It's gonna force him to walk up for assets, but he can't because he's already solo HP, right? So how does he play the game? Well, he can't. Then we traded Salves, which is good. Wave's still pushing it to me. He has no TP because he's playing Ghost. He's stuck in lane. Wave's pushing to me per in perpetuity. He never triple his yet. Well, double his yes. And uh, yeah, now he's 0-2. Noise. Now I have to do a slow push the wave. Yes, we're playing any West. Crash the wave again. I mean, the tricky part is I kind of want Tabis because he's AD, but I kind of want Mercs because... The CC. This is not a timer where I want to ult because the wave is slow pushing away from me. Ulting here would be super bad because uh, the wave would just slow push it to me. You could freeze it permanently. Also, I'm going to slow push this wave chat to then hard push this wave and that, that will set up my reset. And it's because Shen just has a super bad wave, Shen has a super bad wave clear, right? So you kind of have to slow push very often to create good reset opportunities for yourself. So yeah, we slow push into hard push. Well, I'm gonna say hard push this wave, but like hard pushing is just me like tapping the wave and hoping it. There we go. Yes, Terex gives the nasty. Yes. I actually don't need to recall. He's gonna walk up here because he's Twisted Fate. Does he see my blade, you guys reckon? The way he's pushing into me again, by the way. Just pushed the wave again. This guy doesn't have fun to manage. So he's stuck. I'm gonna Q here. Aggressive. Now, the combo that I probably want to do, chat, is drag my blade through him to slow him. And then walk up. Slow him. I hit a man. What that blows. Why oh, is still pushing into me, though? Yeah. 
So, yeah, I mean, we're in a perfect position. One thing I gotta consider here is that my means are gonna get stronger because of level leads in top lane, but enemy mid lane is also ahead of my mid lane, so we're fine. Use Ghost. Wave's pushing into me, even though it doesn't look like it. His means are gonna stay alive, and his minion wave will rise faster. That's what's gonna make this wave push into me. We get flush at the same time, er? I'm gonna do the same trick here, probably slow him with my Q, then flush on top of him, wait till he flush, and I flush too. But he also has Nimbus. Okay, that flash by him was pixel perfect, by the way. Like, he, he could have not stood away a little bit further, and like his ult would have, like his flash would have hit against the wall, but... Well done, nice flash. What are you said? We're double CS still, though, like... Being double CS in a matchup like this, like, it should be reversed in that place. This sucks, though, that I get cancelled. I'm gonna cancel him and his family tree. Now I don't get my reset in, but it's okay. TP will guarantee my reset. So in, so here, like, and, and this is what you have to do as a top lane. You always have to think, no, don't, 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 don't. You always have to think, how will I set up my next reset? Well, I'll just have TP to set up my next reset in a minute. He's dead. Jarvan is tier 2 boots, he will catch up. Oh. Wait a second. Can he EQ? Yep. Oh, Ash. What a game. 2.9, I'm gonna wait for that. I want some different music. Here. Really, a Titanic Hydra in one reset chat. I have uh, not been this rich on my champion before. We're starting to get better on the champion too, though. Finally. Yeah, guys, if you don't know, the longer the Ash Arrow travel, travels, the longer the stun duration is as well. My TP on 92, I have the... Oh, 93. Boom, I'll get it. I also get Sweeper. Oh, I got his Ghost. You're dead cocky, huh? Smartest TF top, suck my cock, get out of top lane, you little pig! Okay, sorry. Create my own song there real quick. And that's for all the TF top abusers. Salute to anybody that lost their LP to uh, TF abusers. That guy can piss off. The guy was expecting some tempi low. He didn't expect the gaming mo potion. Alright, that's not good. Alright, Shrikal though. Um, I... I think time is simply the best this game. Like I said, and Twitch should highlight it as well. We're gonna be going for, uh, Starrox anyways. And tier 2 boots is just really good to have, it gives you extra movement speed, right? Really good in a matchup like this. And look at these two, right? Full AD, all fat, this guy's AD as well, it's only Lilia IP. It's just better like this.
we have the same plush time as Swiss Fate. Mech technical finger primer for shit, bro. Alois and Aloink. I have six grubs. I have ult here, but I would prefer to be level 11 before ulting chat, so that I have like less cooldown on my next ultimate, right? You have level 11, you get more shield, you get less cooldown, so what I think I'm gonna do here is proxy. I mean, I might have to use it though. If we can kill this zone, it's massive. I'm dead. That's a really big shutdown though. Uh, maybe I should have focused the Yon instead of the Lucian, that was 1 HP, I don't know. I think I go for this. Or just straight up Sterox. Now let's go Sterox. Ooh, he's frozen, freezing the cannon for me, what a goat. That guy is good. Path Jetty, take the power ball. XDD walk. Maybe I can get the turret here. The big issue this game is gonna be the Yon. Nice. He's two idols already. I didn't press W. I had he was probably dead. Not gonna be doing much against this guy, huh? Being fed on Shen kind of feels like meh if they are so fed as well because you just don't carry as hard as they can. Uh, how do we win this game? I think we can 5v5, especially if it's like Jarvan ult and Kiana ult. Seems like a pretty deadly combo, but we need to kill the Yon somehow. I think they kill him. Right? Okay, Jarvan gets it. Not the worst. They also have two dragons, six Grub and the Herald. Oh, they have all neutrals. Bro, you can E flash on him, free kill. It's like Yon Q3. <laughs> yeah, bro, I would've killed him there. I would've killed him there, bro. Two full items, would've killed him. Alright, we have two items, we gotta group up for this. So let's play for this. We are missing three key ultimates though, which is pretty pretty tricky. But uh, yeah, it's the best odds we have probably here. How long for their cooldowns? It's 40, 40, 30. This can be good. Oh. 
And they both have flesh. And there's no follow-up. That's too hard. The problem as well with my position is that they are quite ranged, right? So these three champions are super... Uh, uh, these four are ranged. So it's like, I have to dive in to kill them. But if I dive in... So, so the thing is, like, we don't have enough damage, so I have to dive in to kill them. But if I dive in, they my backlog is also exposed. I feel like it's such an impossible position. Because I'm the one that has to peel, but also the one that has to do damage. I don't know. My first taunt was bad. I think if the first taunt lands... He's, oh, actually, he had cleanse even. No. I tried to predict his flash, but nah. I think it's too hard. This guy flashed though. This guy flashed. And this guy flashed. It's it's a really hard game. Even though I'm 5 kills, it doesn't really matter with how far ahead they are. 4 is the 4th range. 1, 2, 3, four. I mean Lilia pretty much plays range. I guess she's a melee champion, but... I can't really let my taunt on her easily. He cleansed my second taunt, yeah, but if I had landed the first one, he would have taunted, or cleansed that. That's what I meant. I missed my E-Flush, right? But yeah, we were also missing key ultimate, so probably I should've just called the way that fight, but it feels so bad to call off fights with my champion, because in the mid to late, all I want to do is kind of team fight, right? So calling off a team fight is still it. Like, if I'm Yorick here, I'm fine giving up third dragon if I get tier 2 here. But getting a tier 2 Ashen is like... Yeah, it's, it just doesn't really change anything for you. I don't know. Hard game. Bro, he spaces into melee range with me. Go! You don't have to ult, he was dead. Trust me, he was dead. Hit. Get gold for yourself. I should have insta eat. I could have. Uh, yeah, we just gapped. I'm fine going next. I think this game's over. Because they're gonna get Nash and they all have soul and they're already had everywhere, so I'm fine going next on this one. Like, you have to realize that this game is just over. There's no way getting back here. Apply by home. Alright. So two out of four here want to play. Oh well, what can you do? What about fundamentals? Did fundamentals don't really I mean yeah, you can apply fundamentals in mid to late, but like let's say tempo macro, right? What are we gonna use here? We can't really split push. And we can team fight, so it feels very dreadful to play in this position as Shen. Again, I win silently against Twisted Fate, but that is absolutely like if this guy goes one or six or one or ten, it, it genuinely doesn't matter. Genuinely doesn't change. And so I can't really split push because I'm Shen. So I want to team fight. My entire team is behind. We want an item behind here. We're like two items behind here. This guy's two levels up, three levels up, three levels up. It's really impossible to play. So sometimes games are over. Trust me, I know when a game is over, in the general sense. And now watch us win this game. Okay, that doesn't have ult now. I'm gonna... I wanna sit here and, like, camp. We need a cheese, we need a catch or something, like a random pick. This 
guy's no flesh. And Zara isn't here, unfortunately. She went for the midwife. <coughs> I block it for my team. He also has shield bow and a Senna ult and a healing and it's full HP. Right. And now they're also getting soul. Ah, just go next team. Piggies. This one is unwinnable. We won lane really hard though. So I hope you guys took away something on how to win against these ranged top and piggies. I'm gonna quickly mute my microphone just to eat. We're gonna queue up again. Next time we're gonna go. Nah, hopefully I have a better environment. Yo, the Bay Jing Beaver. Welcome. Yo, how are you doing, Sparky Boss Man? Yeah, we were running top uh, very hard, but um, there were some inconvenience with the rest of the team. I even had one decent ult to bot lane, but Bentley just got gapped individually. And the Lilia took all the objectives on the map the Grubs, the Herald, and all the Dragons, so I don't know. Not much that I could, uh, could have really done different this game, I feel like. That was even a skirmish in top side where oh, this guy's like four items now, right? Yeah, I don't know. This guy's Bill Gates. Press on. It's all hard. I want to see Fiddlesticks top with the Andrew Tate skin. That's a that's a druted moment, I think. I'm pushing our top wave so they have one less wave to play with. And then we'll probably have a 5v5 where they siege and I don't know, maybe we get a magical play or something, but I don't see it happening when they have soul too. Yeah. Also, the shed has the highest gold in the game, in my team at least. It's not what you want. This Jean could almost 1v5, but like he's not taking damage. I'm so, I, he's growing on me today. Yesterday I was like, well, that champion kind of sucks, but he's growing on me today because I'm also playing a bit better. These games like this suck though, but like this would suck. Like anything I play, I, I would dislike this game. It's just that the problem I have being a champion that wants to facilitate this team is that in a way it feels twice as bad when your team is losing so hard. Like on the one end, you can help them get back in the game, right? Because my champion allows to do that. But if they're losing this, this hard, there's like, I can't split push or play for myself and I don't have a single person to facilitate. So I don't know what to compare the two, but it just, it just feels, it, that just, it just feels like double negative, you know? Sometimes your team is just dog shit, yeah. But let's say if I was Yorick, right? I just push this in, maybe play for tier 2s or stuff like that, but I don't have that luxury anymore. Yeah, no, I should go Thormill, especially with the anti-heal too. Can we kill this guy even? Alright, we did get him. Now we play for Nash. Magical, baby. Here's the magic, it's happening, it's happening. Now we win. Ooh, boars look out. Mm. 
Yeah, I miss Yorick. Yorick is a 1v9 champion. It's way easier to climb with. Thank you, Brady12 Goat. Good to see you, bro. I hope you enjoy your stay and see you more often. Good to see you, boss. If I come back, this one will be pretty hype. The thing is, if I want to come back this one, I don't think it's to me playing good. It's to enemy team playing mistakes. Like, they're like 10k gold up. Mi minimum. And like, three, three levels in like every roll, right? Well... What's this guy building? He's really building the crit item? He already has a knight. Why would he go so that this guy does nothing? Come back, I donate 10 subs. <laughs> yeah. Make it 100. We're not winning this. Kidding, we win this, bro. Give me that 10. Just You just wait a second, bro. Let me carry this game real quick for those tenor. Right. Save that homie. Four items, five items, three items, no biggie, no biggie. Alright, playable. Alright, there's like a 50 million grubs running at me. <clears throat> yeah. Slow and steady suffering. I'm gonna I'm gonna find a solution. Yeah, I don't know. Can't really play. Too far behind. My team that is. Piggy won the game. Okay. That happens though. Not not me. Yeah, it happens. It happens. Everybody's gonna have games like this. All good, all good, all good. Um, like I said, this game is not winnable, right? What I said earlier. There is not a way where I, our draft would randomly like get back in a game like this. For your information, I've never seen this pop up. We issued another player in one of your recent games a penalty for abusing text chat. Reports by you or your teammates continue to help our community to be safe. Thank you. The only report I've done today was on a Milio that said she loves me after I ulted her. And uh, for your information, that guy has been punished. Thank you, Riot Games. I appreciate it. Just the punishment that 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 needed to be done. Don't e like ban the soft inters and stuff. No, ban that guy. Thank you. All right, we're watching a video about how Gripex fell off, uh, and that's uh, just for um, educational purposes mainly, honestly. So I want to learn more about this. We're gonna watch it, and uh, yeah. So be right back. I'm gonna I'm gonna finish my food. Be right back. Okay, Heike, yeah, this this does feel kind of AI generated a little bit. It feels like 
in and of itself. Yeah, it feels full, full general, but I don't know. It's still entertaining. I'm gonna stick with um second wind TP because of Timo, okay? Okay. Let's continue watching. Bro, do you guys remember Wicked? I think I was a go too. Oh no, not this matchup again. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. This is a dream comp for Kale. It's gonna be tricky. I need to not lose lane. I'm gonna stick with TP, I think. Let's see. All right, I'm gonna take my vitamins. It's vitally important. Ha! <laughs> Sorry. We turn on the chill techno mix, and this game will be it. We're playing as Flash Ghost PTA Piggy, so we're playing as a top player without TP, which we can really try and use to our advantage to get some good resets on him. I can look for priority in the early game, and uh, yeah, let's do better than yesterday because yesterday. <gasps> I got destroyed by a kill. It wasn't fun. Oh, sorry. Yeah, mute as well. I keep forgetting. Yikes. All right, I'm gonna blow my nose for one second, sorry. What happened in the game versus Kale? I just got destroyed. All right, aggressive Q and stand here. She's during Kale, interesting, no, no deep blade. So I suppose she's going AP, face check me, baby. I gotta be aware of the PTA. There is no dispute. It's a good trade. Always try and drag your blade through your opponent chat, like that. Just one hit would do. Bompa. Beautiful. We got the shoot second wind, right? So we do sustain way better than the kill does. I wouldn't have lasted this latest frame. No, but nothing is hitting. Yeah! Our wills align. Okay, I'm trying to last at the latest frame, so she's forced to walk up for last or loses herself just because of the means doing the work for me, right? So I go. She got that one. 
She's losing so many last hits here. Beautiful. Good job, mate. Oh, she loses another one. Stay mad, homie. We've only missed one minion. So we're doing an amazing job here. Actually, maybe two. Or maybe I could have cancelled the cannon just by standing on top of it. We're still slow pushing. And then we can do like a fifth wave crash, I guess. Because I'm just slow pushing really, really, really slow. Keep hitting means oh shizer. Ah yeah 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 mama mia The wave at least is good but I didn't consider a team or gank. That's a brutal mistake. <laughs> right, at least other lanes are winning. But your boy in the top lane has been weak sided once again. Teemo's probably still here. Doing a scuttle, could look for another gank. Oh, he's mid. Nice, my mid laner smurfed it. I gotta thin out this wave so kill can never crash. Because remember, this guy's no TP, right? I told you guys that. So if I keep the wave here, she can never really find a good reset for herself. Keeps her stuck in lane. She's gonna lose last hits and stuff like that. I gotta thin out though, cause she's gonna hit level 5 here from 1 million. Gotta zone her from the XP. Nice. She just hit 5, but look at her CS as well. Gotta thin out. Gotta make sure the keep wave keeps pushing into me though, because as long as the wave is pushing into me, she's forced to walk up for last hit shot. She does have flash advantage though. So I probably cannot get a kill, but I'm just trying to get ahead in XP and farm, but uh, I mean, she did get a kill on me. I probably get her flash here. Even better. Alright, we do get the kill. Now we gotta somehow push. I can't. Yeah, this wave is even-ish, but I guess my best place to reset. I think I'm actually buying... I have to be faster on my recall. Yeah, I mean, I lose a full cannon wave here, but so does kill pretty much. But the wave is pushing into her slowly. I had to because of the team of being here. Anyone remember the Shane vs. Kale game from yesterday? No, I don't remember. Don't remind me either, piggy. <laughs> Stream lagging? No, it's you. Alright, we still got in a good position. After all that stuff. Has F close to 6. Good trade, she has no potions. There's a plant in the river that I get to play for. Not sure about this one. If I taunt her, she can't ult, alright? If she's a seed, she cannot ult. So that's one thing I'm considering here. That works as well, Mr. Turon Driver. You're an amazing human being. Well done. Please don't take my wave, though. Please. Yo! Oh, I need level 6. Sure. Wow. Alright. Good, good, good. Even though we got the early game by the team all, we're in an amazing position now. Zuno, thank you for the primer. That was such a good dive timer. Absolutely amazing. I'm gonna team it so I have wave control. 
Hey, I have a problem with toxicity. How can I stop being toxic? I've ranked anxiety. If something stupid happens, I get mad. I have 31 account bad. How can I fix this? Well, I, I, I genuinely am like pretty impressed that you are willing to ask a question like that so openly because you kind of put yourself vulnerable. But it seems like your toxicity is coming out of insecurity in a way. Right, let me focus here. No, never mind, I'm not gonna hold. So, with that in mind, what you should do is only focus on yourself. Now, if your own plays are getting you tilted, there's no way to do that. But ultimately, you need to focus more on yourself, give yourself more responsibility, and approach the game that way. Hold yourself accountable. Something like that. And, and try to play with Muto. Yo, Luis, I'm doing alright, they were asking. But I respect it a lot for saying that, uh, Fredda. 31 permabands is no joke. But you do have the c capacity to say that you have ranked anxiety and that you are getting tilted. But another thing that I can ask is, name one benefit from tilting. There is none. So with that in mind, you are genuinely shooting yourself in the foot by tilting. And if you have ranked anxiety, that's probably from a place of, you know, being scared of being judged, and not being confident enough in your own gameplay. So focus on self-improvement and you'll be good. It's very easy to say that, of course, from my perspective, but that's the mindset that I try to keep as well. You should have a responsible mindset. And then you'll feel much better playing this game. Trust me. It sounds like there is more to that than just leak. Okay, Solorion is uh, psychoanalyzing the entire uh, life of Mr. Uh, homie in chat. Alright, let's focus on the game here. Oh, that W is about as good as my um, Shenmue raid. This wave needs to push back into me, so I actually should stop hitting the wave. Actually, I am depressed. <laughs> Alright, buddy, with that I can't help. I'm sorry, boss. Wish I could. My advice to... Yeah, I don't know. I just want the cannon and dip. You guys know who a good coach is? Alois. I'm gonna here to just slow this guy too. That was a good ghost by her. Thank you, Adox, for the primer. I appreciate it. <clears throat> We're 10 and 5 in this game, but it doesn't feel like that at all. Got our ult, that's massive. Depressed try a win streak. And the thing is... I, I stand completely different in life. I'm a very religious person, so... My approach to, you know, those kind of things are gonna be completely different than what most people probably want to hear from what I've learned, so... Yeah, what's that? Okay, I'm gonna Q. I want to auto E auto her. Or just... I didn't have to flash. And there's a Timo. You're ugly. You're ugly. You're ugly. Oh, good though. You get the kill. <clears throat> Give us a sermon. <laughs> no. We're chilling. How do you convince people to show up for things in Bar like Baron and Dragon? I don't know. S spamming the necessity for that. And if they don't, then you probably don't fight. I don't know. Oh, like Mauli. Okay, it works. Scottish AD. Do I ult?
Mind is controlled. I do lose a full wave here, though. With balanced decks. <clears throat> Who feels better this far, Yorick or Shen? Definitely Yorick. We're struggling with the Shen. I deal with tanks, especially Malphite on Riven. Um, yeah, it's very tricky. There's a lot of things to talk about there, of course. Alright, let me focus here. The thing is with, with tanks is if your team is not helping you shut them down early or you're... Oh. Come on, leave me alone, Timo. On my ass the whole game. Sorry, I want to I want to focus on the gameplay, but sorry, Chatter. Well, at least we do way better against the kill this game than we did yesterday. I'm feeling Timo is still here. I get level eleven from this wave. Maokai and Timo are here. <clears throat> Yo, one more super, good to see you, boss. Singed when? But what, what is everybody's obsession with Singed in general, by the way? Why don't you want to see Singed? What is Singed even about? Hello, guys, I am proxying. It's like not playing the game. That's recall. Actually, I can think I play for this. I don't see Trindamere. Next champion we do is gonna be a carry though. Yes. I'm gonna do like Gangplank, Jace, Trindamere, Olaf, something like that. No sanction that list. Please don't ban me though. Oh, that blinded is so unlucky. If you hard push, I can stay for another wave. You clearly didn't watch Arcane. Was Sanction Arcane? He was. But I just made Shimmer. He just made Shimmer. Guys, like, whatever. Side roll. Oh, that ignite was aggressive. Yo, Lotix, I'm doing pretty good. They were asking boss. Hope you're doing amazing yourself. Ah, oh, this has to be some ward or something. Oh, push one more wave. I get my third ultimate hunter stack. I think if Kale is here, even with ghosts, I can escape. Oh, there's a fast Timo. If anybody flames my wall, I'm perma banning you. Thank you, Gurpsy, for the two one. Yungle. We'll do Yungle eventually. I, ex I explained it before what my content ideas are right now. So I don't want to repeat everything right now. I will do other rules eventually, but not for the time being. I think Lucian should not be looking to one on that. My professional opinion. Uh, I'm gonna go Sterox. Good job, team. I mean, we have pretty good control with the map. Just, we need to play for neutrals. They have five grubs and two dragons. So, Mauka flesh. Ooh. Bomba. I have ult, but don't need it. There's a Teemo there. Now we're gonna do Trundle again. We're actually gonna do Trundle again, because I didn't make it a YouTube video, and it was like, too rushed. It was like, at the end of Season 13. Literally the last day of Season 13, like, and so it would instantly be outdated, and I decided to not upload it, so we can do it again. LTP here, just so I can throw this bot side. <clears throat> Alright. I think we have a pretty good position to start team fighting. Like, my team has been playing well this game, so there's some homies to play for. Understood. 
I need to learn to play with F keys, honestly, playing this champion. I never used F keys before, but honestly, having F keys is so important on the champion. There we go. Perfect example. FF! Yeah, I get ultimate on the stack, though. It's fine. Yeah, you want this fight, baby? I need to stop calling people baby, though. Genuinely. Something wrong with me. Goodbye, baby. Oh, and six Silas flesh on it anyways. Are you gonna redo Camille's this year shit this season? That would be interesting, yeah. That could be interesting. Alright, we'll I'll need to play next dragon for sure. Dragon is gonna be in sync with the Baron. Oh. Come on, man. This Lucian is, is the only one that's like behind this game. Ugh. If this Kale gets to scale, we are in trouble. A lot of trouble. Now we're chilling though. Well, that was just a really nice skirmish to fight myself in. Random as shit. Bomba. Alright, we get Stadarx. Let's just play for this and this. Which group goes five. Right. My Gragas has two items. What I also do before joining a team fight chat, is, and it's super important, is you check the summoners of your teammates. So right now I know Gragas is no flash, so I'm not gonna anticipate for like a Gragas E flash. Um I'm not I know that Galio's no flash. Lucian and Lux have flash, I don't I don't have to peel them like super hard. The Silas is a complete si banana combo. The Scottish AD even. Oh, this champ is toxic. Stop it. My bad. We don't do that again. <coughs> well done, boring for me. Well done. We just give up this to play turret, I can't defend it the way I play it. I should have just played for wave clear. Calls people pigs gets issue with baby. I call people piggies. Piggies are a very intelligent animals. So whatever. Alright, we know to play for Nash now. Go five to Nash. Let's catch the Teemo, make sure we can't make a minefield and we're always chilling I just hate that the only job I have at this part of the game is not to split push and play for tier 2 which is what I always want to do I want to play for my own resource but I have to play to like set up fights with my team and win the game that way that's what I dislike about Shun I don't like the playstyle inherently it's tank play gameplay it's facilitating gameplay piggy gameplay but it's different which is refreshing Dragons do a bomba. Mm, I gotta defend this. I gotta defend this. Oh, please. Oh, please. I gotta push out side wave. I get TP because I have ult to join anyways. So I just can temp on the side wave here. The Kale is scaling, so that's scary. Nice. This kill here? She's probably buying her item. Yeah, she got her item. She has a rage split now. Oh, I should have ulted him. I'll get my flesh in a second. Oh, this is so bad. Okay, I'm 
one shot that guy, I think. My E kills myself. We need to be S5. Ah, it's a problem, man. They just get the skill. And this is what I hate. My Lucian was randomly caught. My Gragas was randomly caught. I don't know. Ooh. Can I buy the Sheen something? Ah, I think it's better. More diverse. I don't know. Shouldn't eat this Teemo like that, I guess. But. I don't know how to win this one. We are 25 and 17 in kills, but it feels like we are behind. And I don't know why. It's because my champions or the champions we play require skill to like get catches, right? Like Galio, Gragas. They're 09 Silas, and it's like super hard to play. Can I want to force Nash so like we force a 5v5 whilst we are still stronger before Q gets level 16 and, and then they will just win the 5v5 and then I don't see how we win the game anymore because she will split push and win 5v5. So I want a 5v5. Why no magic assist? That's, that's a pretty good question. I definitely should have magic assist. Oh my days, it blocked the Baron too. Okay. Nice, actually did something well. Please just start the Afking Nash for once in your lives. Stay on it! P piggies! Ah, uh, whatever. It's, it's full flip, man. Team has no flash. Stay on Nash. The kills don't matter. We need the Nash. Okay, nice. Okay. Man, this game's hard. From the shadows. I need to stop Eing when I leave the base. I keep using my E and then I don't have it. What the... Bro just decide. Oh, he actually gets out. That's crazy. What's even going on, man? This guy is... Only two items. He's not even that strong, actually. And my Galio got a lot of kills and stuff, but he's, they, they are not that strong. Ash is somehow also a higher level. Kill's going for bot lane. But she's gonna be level 16. I might want to get Terminus myself as well.
Don't hide it from me. You all, or if you each get old. Domination, team the primer, push it. it. Yeah, she's gonna get 16 soon. That's what I'm scared of too. And I have soul point. Okay, my team is doing something good without me. Ash flash there. Thank you for the 100. I'm your friendly reminder, don't eat out of base. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Thank you for the 100, bro. Mm. You don't want to eat out of base because it kind of instantly makes you like um, if you if you want to randomly wreck your play, be the TP, be the ult, you don't have your E, which is can be literally game deciding. Is this guy just dead to shrooms? Wow, they're all here. Ugh. I'm not sure if we can win this one, chat. How do we win? We need a catch. Probably. With like Galio Gragas. But I don't know. Their Ash is two levels higher than my AD carry. Their jungler is two levels higher than my jungler. And it feels very hard to play, even though we are ahead with 10 kills. It, it doesn't feel like that the whole game. I'm about to die botland there, of course, by the way. That has nothing to do with my team. Yeah. This is what makes Shen feel so depressing to play. I can't really carry the game. He's dead. We just lost, I think. Actually, we're fine. Timo and Ash don't have flash. As long as we wave clear, we can maybe try and deny their soul point. Well, silence flash on me. That's a piggy play. National flash either. We can get Soul and Nash with that. Okay. A little bit uh, weird, but we need to get this and this. We need to get both. I'm gonna TP here maybe to stop this guy. Somebody died to shrooms. Whatever, I'll just sit on this. She's too tanky because of Terminus. Well. I'm high key getting annoyed with the champion. I don't know. Last game against Suicide Fate, he's like 1 and 8, and like, they just win because I can't do anything on the map. But like, this game again. Ah. <sighs> Hey, it sucks. I need I need good players. But at least have decent players. I oh, just have F. I'm not having fun in this challenge thus far, chat. I do firmly believe that the higher elo I get, the better it will get. But 
like I'm still in platinum MMR because of how bad our start was, and that makes this just a little bit dreadful. Playing this MMR and then losing a game that I should never be losing. Whatever, let's stop complaining. I could have made maybe some better decisions this game too. Oh, Timo stops right here. Now I'm here. If we come back from this, as I would like, uh, I don't know, give me the medal of biggest comebacks. If we win this, I'll just smile. I'll smile if we win. Alright, read some music. What's good music? Repentless. Name is bad though. Never mind, this is not it. This is the song we need. This is the song we need. The only good comeback song. Somebody's just gonna walk into our base and end the game, but let's hype it up though. Shit! Sorry. Why is my Lux higher level than my 80 carry? That shoot. Holy moly. I'm scaling! Scaling! Defend! Tower defend! Goodbye, little piggy. Get him! Before she get old! Before she get old! Before she get old! Ah! Got an angel! Pig. Get him before she get old! I'll, I'll E. I'll E. Get him, get him, get him, boys. Get him, boys. Get him, boys. Boys! Shoot! Base, base, base! Base, base, base! Too deep, too deep, too deep! Oh! Lucian! Useless. <clears throat> I'm hard stuck! A chain! Chat, why did you guys choose Shen? <laughs> How do we climb on the champion? How do people do it? Who gets it? Two run driver can get it. Defeat after defeat in low elo, trying to sell courses, kicked up you. Your mom is fat. Put me in, coach. No, I can't do it. That's not allowed. That makes it. That makes it too broken. Good to see you, Tyson. I hope you're doing amazing, brother. <clears throat> All right. Let's finish watching this video about. My grip X fell off. I don't like to lose my games. My teams are pigs. My teams are pigs. Playing Shen and Platinum. I am F King Stock! 18 games in, still Platinum. Bro, if I'm like. Oh, whatever. Emerald's gonna be fun. If this flight, oh, I wonder how Emerald's gonna be, by the way. It's alright, Copy. It's alright, Copy. 
Might need a break on this one, actually. Like, I, I'm actually gonna get, like, annoyed playing this shit. I think he's a dead now. I had to report you for saying your mom is fat at the Lois and Nell smiley face. It's okay, bro. Don't care. We can do that. We can do that, bro. Play two in our matchup. That's okay. That's okay. Bro, he had 100k views on his videos. What do you mean? That's the thing, though. As a content creator, he took a shit ton of breaks. I feel like that's a death sentence. Would you ever drop a challenge if it gets too hard? Then then the challenge would have beaten me. And I don't like to be beaten. Nowadays you could probably survive on 300 viewer streams. No, that's not true, bro. No, that's not true. I mean, it depends on your living conditions and your, your goals. But let's say you have like anybody helping you with editing or anything like that. Then simply impossible. Simply impossible. I don't like when I started streaming. Um, when I started streaming last year, for the first six to seven months, I think the revenue I made from YouTube and Twitch combined was like a, what like was like one k euros, and that that you cannot live from that. And I was sitting around 300 ish viewers then. Living break. Thank you for the tier one, bro. And that was YouTube and Twitch combined, right? So no, that is not possible. Al one he Al one he boss, keep it up. Thank you so much, bro. Thank you for the eleven. I, I was like the the biggest uh, what I was doing next to streaming and YouTube was was coaching right that's how I that's that's what kept me like uh, security <clears throat> yeah and he had two K viewers average he had, like one hundred K views on YouTube like you you like good money with that bro all right let's see we'll play against Stormer uh, I think I'm pretty good against that draft because melee champion melee champion melee champion pretty good with my W against these two. I can peel really well. I like my draft here. I just hope my team plays pretty well. Oh. 1k euros is a high jump in my country. Rent in the Netherlands. If I wanted to rent somewhere here. I'm gonna grab some grass stock. Rent where I live right now. Just rent. Is around... And, and, and this is, like, I, I'm not kidding, by the way. It's around 1.5k euros. Just rent. That's just rent. So, no. I, I know. Impossible. Um, Netherlands is a very expensive place, though, to live.
Thank you, you see that play, mate? Yeah, the music is way too loud. I'm sorry. There you go, fix it. Yo, artist. One, one K five euro for a bedroom or for a studio? Depends. If it's in a city, it's like 50 square meters. 1.5 K euro easily. You can just search Amsterdam rent in the Netherlands or like Harlem. That's where I live. Okay, let me focus though. He crit me twice. I'm gonna hit my level 2 here. He can't Q when I eat him. Piggy! The wave is pushing away from me though, so I have to stay. But my jungler is going away. I'm in a very bad spot. I actually need my jungler, I think. I need my jungler, but this jungler won't come to me. If he's very smart, the jungler comes here. He's coming. What a goat. I think you should have stayed hidden a little bit. Okay. It's really massive. Even though it doesn't look like it, what Lee sent it here is, is really important for me. What a goat. And he gets a kill for it. Nice. <clears throat> Bro, I'm paying 3200 USD in rent in California, so just shy of 3k euros. Cheapest option in my area. What? That genuinely makes me sick to read, by the way. That makes me sick to my stomach. I mean, I know salaries are probably higher where you're living too, but 3k euro? That is... I don't know, man. That's criminal. That's criminal. Yikes, man. Pay by the Leah Tenor? <laughs> Bro, that guy deserves everything. The goat. Alright, let's focus here though. We had a really good early game, but I was a little bit caught up with the discussion with the bros. What a trade by Young, young Shen player. And he lost the cannon. Now this guy is about to run it down. Yep. I'm just gonna flash because the wave's pushing him to me, and the faster he dies, the more he's going to lose. But I was here as well, so but I just get rid of him. Boys, we're starting to get a little bit of a better hang of our abilities, that's for certain. I'm gonna try and see if I can find the Briar. I don't know where she's at. Oh, wait, I do know. Oh, and I dragged it through her. And she thinks she can win. Goodbye, little piggies. Got a space here. Option. So there, chat. I dragged my blade through him. Got three empowered abilities. Dragged my blade through him again. Got three empowered auto attacks again. One shot with Ignite. Alright, well... We're gonna get a good game here, finally. Nice. I mean, I've completely annihilated this game already. And that's what I always recommend for Shen players to do. Utilize your early game strength if you don't, and you play Shen, like, safe early, you're just losing out on everything. Yo, Ardis, how are bro? I mean, maybe it's good for you, but I hope it's good for you, bro. It's good to see you. And it is uh, patat, trouwens. Alright, um... Lower and Platinum. Hardstock.
I am angry because of that last game. I kind of don't want to ult. I mean, maybe I should ult. I probably really should ult. I probably really should have ulted. No, I should have ulted. Like, I'm gonna lose like two ways for doing that, but killing this 0 4 Trinimer won't change the outcome of this game. Denying them fights bot lane can win me the outcome of the game. I should play for. I should have ulted here, man. I should play for my team. Like, killing this guy again doesn't do anything. I'm a pig. After Shen, I'm not going to do tanks for a while. I guarantee you guys that. And if I play a tank, I would play a tank that can split push like Scion or, or Mundo or something like that. Yeah, next vote will be uh, Trundle, Gangplank, Jace, Olaf, something like that. I get an assist on the fist as well, so I get my ultimate hunter stack there too. Beautiful. Look at the shem damage, bro. No, he leveled up. Shoot, bash, baby. Well, this game was fast. Boys, I need games like this because I want to get out of this MMR fast, chat. This client will genuinely be better the high elo I get because people will know how to play and utilize my ultimate. But in this MMR, people run around like headless chickens. But I, I generally don't have a better reference than like that. Where can we vote? It's in the Discord. There's a voting channel, but it's not open right now. It will be closer to when like I'd actually do the challenge. So yeah. I'm gonna go see the R boots. I just go like full watch it now. Got some balance damage. I'm gonna keep my Q until I've eat through him. By wave. 30 seconds for my ult. I want 900 gold on my reset, so I have CDR boots. Fizz could look for me. He's gone bot. My mid and jungle are winning too, so that's good. I think I can stay. I don't think Trinidad can kill me, realistic. 
Yes, if you go to my YouTube, you can see the list of all the champions I did already. There's a playlist on YouTube with all the unranked matches that have been done. Wait, I might be dead. Shit. That's the only way he gets back in the game, by me dying like a pig, like actually like a pig. Oh, this game's not won yet, especially if I give him that, because I'm gonna lose a wave now, and he's gonna get like multiple plates. The one turret shot made the difference, by the way. This one turret shot killed me. The Ineon, that's amazing. So you're watching the Gwen video, and you're in the Twitch stream. My man. Based. A, a wee bit of great. A wee bit of great, my. Oi. Yeah, you're right, though. A wee bit of a good ultimate, eh? Are you a pig? Let's get this guy too. Close out this game. I want my last ultimate on the stack. Boys. Alright, we got all the ultimate hunter stackers. Gotta win. We got 13 kill participation before minute 13. It's pretty good. I'm here due to Lunar. You remember him? He's a Dutch AD carry man, right? I remember Lunar. That's the one you're referring to. That's not good. My top five favorite champions. Uh, Camille, Fiora, Riven, Gwen. Yorick maybe actually. I like Yorick so much. Get my patience. Yon died to grubs. I don't want a repetition of last game. <clears throat> I can't fool 1v9. Oh, actually, Garen is one of my favorite as well. There's so many champions to love in the League of Legends, man. It's still hard to keep track. Is Bork. You guys know who a good coach is? Alois. Pushing the second wave and then we reset. Hi at Alois underscore NL, my PhD supervisor as Dutch. Could you teach me a Dutch phrase which will impress him? Grin, grin. Say? Ah. Oh. A Dutch sentence that will impress him. Uh, you caught me off guard with that one. Thank you for the prime, Sharfi. I can't think of anything on the fly. Yo, any Dutch homies wanna help? What do we teach him? It's not something weird though, chat. Keep it. A bit of one shot. Alright. Wasn't meant to be. Say <laughs> op je mail werken voor je kanker. Ah, I couldn't have uh, thought of anything else. The most Dutch answers here. I want somebody else to get the kill. Never mind. Oh. Good. Naked on the keuken. That one was obviously coming. Wait, I'm just dead again. There's no one here anymore. I'm griefing. You guys are distracting me! AK, it's all your fault, chat. It's all your fault. It's never my fault. It's never streamer's fault. Yeah. 
We have to focus because I put Trinner back in the game with these deaths and like my team is already not performing super well. They're not performing bad, but we're two dragons down. My AD carries one and three, you know, it's, it's not looking too hot. Beter één vlieg in je hand dan tien in je soep. Seven. Oh, he's taking my shit. I'm gonna act as I'm walking to the top lane, but I'm an actor, so I'm gonna go back here. And I have old how pressure side lane. But you can get banned for saying diseases? Can you get banned for saying diseases? Is this saying like I mean can like that disease of course is a horrific word, but do you can actually get banned is that against TOS? He actually has it again. Not sure how worth, but I'll take it. So worth. Is that on me? Oh shit, I did an ult. I was in shock, but I didn't expect a fight to occur. Did you see that listen? Did you see that listen? Just, just, so, just so we all saw that, right? Like, see the shen though. I have 80 kill participation, and there's a world where I'm losing this game. That doesn't work. Oh, this game. Oh, yeah, I should give this water. Sorry. A little bit more gold. Would you ever do an Orion rank to master? It's gonna take a very long time before I consider doing a tank again after this, okay? Like, this is a prime example. In a normal game like this, if I'm 13 kills, I don't even have to consider if I'm gonna win the game or not. This game, I'm scared that I'm losing. And that is because I am reliant on my teammates, and my teammates have no idea how to play the game around this anymore. And so I can be as fed as I want, but if I have piggies! It's hard to win. Now, I can fault myself for dying twice to the Trindamere, which is more than reasonable. But I've already pointed those out. Those were bad deaths. Shouldn't have died to Trindamere. This guy has two kill participation. I find that to be extremely special. Like, how... I have a feeling I'm losing this. By the way. By the way. The one kill he has was like a max range WKS for me as well. Or just 1-9 carry if you're fed low. Welcome to AD carry, low. AD carry is weak. Oh, the problem is being a tank in a solo queue environment. And he flushed out. I mean, I understand that.
There's gonna be a point where Trinimar outskills me, right, chat? So then I can't sideline anymore, but it looks like I also can't team fight. I'm 20 kill participation, I'm losing the game. That was pretty smart. Now we can get Nash. That's how hard I have to 1v9 on a tank. I really hope this works. Slippery fish. Normal human. What do I buy, Chad? I I'll try this, whatever. I don't know what else to build. <sighs> I have two items, two items here now, and they get some levels from the Nash, so that's good. Again, this guy's 10 kill participation. This guy has 2 kill participation, which are the people that get the most. I have 21. I have more than these two combined. I almost, I think I have the same kill participation as everybody in my team combined. So I'm only making solo kills pretty much. Man, the champion is hard to climb with. I think I'm also just like actually getting shit teams though. I couldn't shoot. Oh, come on. Where's the fish? I gotta keep defending this guy too, which is so frustrating. This guy will only split push the entire game. So annoying. I gotta go terminus actually. That's the item I need. I forgot this item exists. This guy will only split push. I gotta itemize against that. Building more health is useless because he has border. I also, like, whilst I have 23 kill participation, I also have the highest CS in this game. And of course I know I'm smurfing, but it's like I'm playing a tank, right? Like, that's what I gotta... I understand that perspective that I'm a smurf, but... You see the issue I have with climbing on the champion? Like, I, I, I can't win games unless I do absolutely everything. This is the wrong item, so I'm gonna sell it. How about this? Why not? I don't have sweeper, so I don't know if this bush is worth it or not, but I'll figure it out by their movement. Doesn't, oh, doesn't look like it. Penta! Wait, do I get a penta? No. Good try. Him losing flash ghost is fine. Kill him, right? Nice. This game is not easy. But we're in there. We are in there. Yo, Ham Nan, good to see you, boss. This guy's not old. He might go for my red buff, so I'm gonna defend that. But after the wave. Leash. Your E deals damage to buffs as well. If they push up, no, they won't. Uh, I mean, oh, this guy's walking into me. 
Nam is flanking. That's a bad flash by me. Shouldn't flash after that. They have so much movement speed. Should know that. I have terminus now. No. What is the... Shouldn't be this hard to win a game, I feel like. Can can I please win my game? 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 I like how my Hawaii says, One Vincent! She has five kill participation, man! He is scaring our fat ass so hard. Whatever. Gotta push outside again before Trinomer goes there first. What even is this, man? Like, like out of any champion, why am I put on Shen duty? Any champion with this score with 1v9. Any champion but a tank. Only a tank wouldn't. That's why I don't like playing tanks in solo queue, chat. If you need more reference points as to why I never play tanks in solo queue, this would be the prime example. I don't have ult. Okay, let's do Nash. Let's do Nash. Two people are 1 HP. Take the midwave out. You're the person who put them in the phone, don't gaslight us. You are wrong, but you guys chose it. Oh, you're right. You might be right. But shut up. Yeah, I go Tabby's now. Well, is there a way to optimize this build? Maybe Sunfire for something else? But I have 30, 31 kill participation out of 38, by the way. And this guy is like 15. I've doubled my jungle skill participation. <laughs> oh my days. What a game this is. Like, genuinely, what a game this is. There's no flash. Oh, nice. Well done. We actually got a kill without me. He's watching his mid lane. Look, dude, even enemy teams like surprised that my team is doing something. Kidding. I'm also almost 10 cents per minute, by the way, chat. Go, 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 go. I have W for you. We have a Mian, that's enough, we can end. We can end. Bro, like... I want a game of Shen. That's what you gotta do to win games of Shen. Wait a second, I'm talking too fast. No, we haven't ended. No, we can't end. We're not hitting Nexus turrets either.
and you guys grow some hands. Five voice cracks. We shouldn't walk up here. We're like two v five. Somebody else take it, I'm full build. Alright, oh, you can take it. Listen, kicks him. Listen, kicks him when he's when he's already protected by my W. That's like so you you can wait till like the Shen W runs out and then like you kick him. Over. No, let's just kick him while he's in the W so we can't defend Arik anymore. Yes, Jin got that scout though. Yes, he just did. Wait, my Yon? Yon grew hands. All right. I like how, like, I like how out of everybody, the Hawaii is multi, like, trying to micromanage people. That guy's, like, the last person to, to anybody to do. This is guy, like, ah, uh, whatever. This is the guy that inherited, like, 5 million euros by his dad, lost it all two years later, and tells people how to manage their finances. That's that guy. Doesn't know anything about the game? Don't go there. Don't go there. This is bad. This is good. Well, good thing it's smaller skills, right? And your own skills, so... Somehow my champions or my teammates will do something soon. In a way. Oh, I got two inhibs. Well done, team. Uh oh Where does Texas Walder have? 250 or something. 269. Guys, I can't. Like, every, every, every side I see is, like, triggering me more and more. Like, it's genuinely triggering watching this game play. What's this game, buddy? I'm, I'm telling you, you don't want to know. Where did this Jing W come from? I came from the sky. We really gotta play for Bear now. I'm actually gonna push both. No, oh, go away! The F out! You don't have old like I do. Please, Jin, go for another wave. You know you got to. We won't. But I can make this wave go faster. Yo, you have E! Listen, you have old! How does he almost kill three people? No, I... Chat, I can't, I can't focus. It is so... It is so weird! No, I don't trust you guys to end. I really don't. We're gonna take Nash and, and deny the soul. Wait, they did something. Okay, we can end. We can end. We can actually end. Please don't die to Fizz. I hit the tomb perfect. Of course I did. 
It's not enough though. I think we can end if this being stays alive. I have my W, we don't have Lee Kick. I, I didn't use my W. I griefed there. I actually griefed. I didn't use my W. No, I griefed. Now we need to defend the soul. Yon. The reason I want yeah, I to there. say is because he's small and people take him seriously. Oh no, they were prime. They were prime, bro. Guys, I'm on edge. I'm aging five years from this one game. So you guys can call me 37 years old, not 42. Or not 32, whatever, man. Nobody's full build yet either. <laughs> oh, this guy is now. Can I please win? Every win that I have with Shen, indeed, is like 14 minutes, and I have to play like perfect for 40 minutes. It cannot be hard to end. As five, can't lose. Lee, save R for Trint. What else do I have to type? Unlucky. Wait, that procs Cleaver? That burn? That's crazy. Even Smolders. We won. We won, chat. We won, but at what cost? I don't even feel good. I won, but it's like I'm. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, we won. No, no, we won. Twenty-four kill game, Shen. That's what I have to do to win one game with the champion. No, I won, Shen. I won. <laughs> what to do about it? And guess what, Chet? Guess what? Guess the elo. Guess the elo we're playing. Fucking platinum, man! I can't get out. I'm stuck. I'm stuck! This is the only way I had to win! That's fine. So who gets it? Well, he did the level 3 gank, I guess. Now imagine getting plus 18, <laughs> minus 30. Yeah, I, I, I would queue up for another day. But why would you willingly main Shen? But I have several losses already. Look at the damage graph. <laughs> <laughs> How are you <laughs> are my teammates, bro? Thank you for the primer, Heineck. <laughs> like, how unironically useless are they, man? A man has died this game. Oh, this is gonna take so long before we are done with Shen. Let's queue up again. Use all the <laughs> use all the revenue from this client to get a good therapist. It is rough. Yeah. I think in the, in my free time I'm gonna start fishing to build my patience to climb on this champion. I don't know. This is the game we had before. I couldn't carry this one. Uh, <laughs> uh, well, we won, right? Did imagine, like, imagine that, that I had to play Pixel Perfect, right? And I know how to do so because I'm a challenger player. But th that's that's what it requires for me to win one game in this elo on Shen. It and and I made two mistakes dying. Like I gave a one k shot to the tournament once, and then I died again. I'm like, okay, like I maybe we can actually lose, even though my team was even at, like ahead, right? They they just kept making so 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 many mistakes.
It is beyond crazy what happened this game. But we won. We got we got the bag, guys. We got the bag. So uh, type one in chat if you want to willingly play tanks in solo queue. Because it's good. It's good to play tanks in solo queue, right, chat? Let me just play tanks in solo queue. Whew. Yeah, it's not the music. Bro, look at deep low AI score of 127. Yeah, I performed 127% this game. I agree. Actually, let's keep this music running. It's pretty chill. Ted is taken. I'm not gonna do one one right now. I'm sorry, brother. I I I need LP. Okay, we need LP. I'm rolling at this. What? What was this? Sorry, Ted is taken. Mods, can we refund it? I'll do it another day, brother. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, shit. It's cringe to watch myself. I always find it cringe to watch myself. <laughs> the camera... Dude, the camera flips are so iconic, though. I love it so much. When I hit my desk, it's like, oh, that no, doesn't do it. Whatever. Okay, I can't command it. I can't do it on command. It's not a good dog. My camera's not a good dog. Oh, whatever. It's it, it is it is the way it is. It is the way it is, bro. Ted is taken more like Ted is stam scammed. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry, chat. I'm sorry, Ted is taken. But you're like, you're asking, it's like, it's like ask, like the game I had to play just now, it's like, I just went to school, studied 20 hours for every test, failed every test, okay, at home, my pet died, my, my grandma's in the hospital, and you come and Twitch chat, Alois, do you want to do 1v1? No, I need my LP, that's what I need. Holy shit, I'm actually like getting really disturbed right now, never mind, I shouldn't, I'll take back everything I said, sorry chat, my bad. I think it was Tom Brady who said that he never watches his own games, they make him nervous. I don't like, I mean, I love watching my own stream, like watching my own voice, like watching my own stuff. Hi, Keto chat. There was a hint of truth in my message. I met, I remember one time I, ha I had to go to school, it was winter, and I had to do a test later. So I got home, it, just, it was just a little bit dark and I got home and... My homie, my cat Morris, had passed away randomly. He was just like a healthy cat, completely fine, had a stroke, died. That was like one of my saddest days, for sure. Yes, sir, Daffy, thank you, bro. Clap match up again. Earlier went good. Well, I'm not gonna be able to eat the Ezreal or the Artie unless they are, like, griefing. No, it's alright, Tizer. Just refund the point to Ted is taken. The 1v1 is a mental break from Shen. Yeah, I don't know. What school did you went to? A school in the Netherlands is a high school. I'm not gonna tell you the name of my high school. I'm not gonna tell you the name of my high school. I think that's weird. Holy moly, chat. Stuck in platinum on Shen. Who would have thought? Not me. Not me indeed. Maybe a bit. Oh, this this song is called "Suffer Through." This is our Shen climb. This song is called "Suffer Through." That that is kind of that's pretty kind of accurate. Suffer through, suffer through. That's what Shen is all about. Facing our problems head on, suffering through the depths of platinum, playing a tank that wants to facilitate his teammates, but they are limpless, headless chickens. Although what's my blood type? I don't even know. All right, we're in the Emerald Elo now. Emerald four, though we're barely scratching Emerald. Never mind, the matchmaking is all over the place. Ah, whatever. Well, we'll see. 
no, cool and bad. I have not. If you want to see all the underrated mess I did, you type estimation mark UG, you figure it out there. On that note, chat, on that note, I've uploaded a new video today, like every day, daily YouTube videos. Let me search it up. It's a video where I will re uh, where I react to a, an Iron player. It's a new series I want to do, this YouTube video. If you could all spend the time, if you have it, to just check it out. If you have five, ten minutes, see if you like the video idea. Maybe give me some feedback. If you guys like the idea, I'm down to make it a series. As you guys can see, you guys, you guys can send me thoughts and I want to react to it, make it entertaining and educational. If the idea is liked, we can do it more. My view is that it's interactive because you guys sent me your votes. I react to it, make a video, something like that. It's good. That, that's basically it. So yeah, there's that. Comments have amazing ideas for the series. Name it. What are the comment section cooking? Wait, I gotta search it up now. What is the comment section cooking? Name for the series. <laughs> Helping piggies. Funding your <laughs> mentals. Oh. Uh... <laughs> Please use take this the right way as it's meant as a compliment. I use your videos to fall asleep. Oh my days. Man, you're 10 years younger, and I only picked Plat 1 before Emerald was implemented, like Season 6 or something. Okay, I'm not gonna read all that, never mind. Fundament thoughts, that one is trash. Something with Piggy. I guess people like helping Piggies. That's pretty inventive. Alright. Alloys! The idea is great, can they LS there first? Oh, no, you can You can send me your votes from LAS. All you have to do is join the Discord, though, and, and do the correct format. It's just There's a section there called votes, you can send your votes there. That's how it goes. So I would set up. All right, uh, breaking Benjamin for this one because breaking Benjamin is elo potion. I think. I hope. I need something to give me elo. Yumbo Dirk or Aha croissants, bro. I don't really like croissants. I'm sorry, chat. I don't like croissants. Give me eggs or oatmeal for breakfast. The gold bad bomb thing. No, oh, he kind of beat me there. I'm gonna be honest. All good though. Let's focus. 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 Okay. I have Kaiserun, great, says my Nautilus. Well, I can see Halo Blades not as being functional. He just stacks his passive on three people and CCs them. Right, chat? Right, chat? Right, chat? <laughs> good news, we have good early. Okay, let's go, bro. Bomba. I need to put my blade way more aggressive. Level 2 timer. He's playing TP. And he's dead. Solid. Good news, we have good early. And they died. Who would have thought chat? Type one in chat if you thought anything else would happen. I love playing Shen. Flash Ghost. Halo Blades Nautilus in my team. <sighs> Just another day on the job, chat. That W was about as bad as it can get. Now he cannot let me. Well, I'm gonna get level 4 actually, we're fine. Oh, there's a Diana. If we kill Diana, I get level 4.
We don't want to push the wave. Well, thank you, team, for pushing the wave. Let's dive him then. Never mind. Never mind. Yeah, boy, the top line is doing his job again, though. I want Tavis or Bobby Cinder, but I can't. Clay doesn't have enough pushing power to get this in, though. But I have to recall chat because he has TP, right? So if I'd stayed there and I tried to contest the wave and he gets his wheelchair back and then he like pushes the wave and bases TPs, I'm stuck. But if I base TP right now and walk back and get the fr wave frozen here and I can maybe look to cancels. Well, he's level 5, so probably can't do shit, but let's see. I get the first blood to, well, I get the kill to Viego, which is good. Clay is losing most of the wave here, which is also good. We're in the 5 position. I'm right as his. I gotta thin out the wave, but my champion has no wave clear. I actually can't believe I put a champion without wave clear. On the list. The champion that comes close to like Shen is like... Tom Kench, I guess. Also like no wave clear. He TP'd by the way. I want to hold this wave where this wave comes so that I can like keep it frozen here. So I walk forward. We're in an amazing position here. Q for the main damage with the passive. Good. You know who I miss, chat? You know who I'm missing? Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Now, for the people that haven't watched it, who is Ed, Ed, and Eddie? Those were the homies when we were playing Yorick. We don't have the homies anymore. And the top is lonely without the homies. It's okay, we have Twitch it. I'm becoming... A weirdo. I need to put my next skill a little bit more aggressive. Like... Here, aggressive. Don't fight this, I think. Not against Ari and Kled. The wave is still frozen here, so we're in a really good spot. Homies left like her. Where's the wife? Yeah. Where? Your mom won't answer. Clutch is just roaming for fun. Oh, we're still freezing. That doctor? Fundamental doctor. Fundamental doctor is not a bad one actually. Arcane wings, thank you for the suggestion. Fundamental do oh, do we need ult? I better ult preemptively so I can insta W he Wow. That's an Ari. Dead Nautilus Flash. Surely moly. Do you guys see that Nautilus flash? Point blank, just like that. I do have three ultimate hunter stacks with three assists, which is good. I'm doing my job. Gonna be hard again. Fundamental doctor, Mr. Fundamentals. Press on. Press on. My Halo Blade Nautilus is a shutdown. Of course, he gets two out of three kills. Oh my days. Nice. I'm winning my lane pretty pretty hard, by the way. Fundamental Wrangler. 
Fundamental Wrangler School. Okay, sorry, that one. The Wrangler School guy, that guy's amazing, by the way, the homie. If you guys know, type one in chat if you know, like, the Wrangler School guy, the YouTuber. That guy's amazing. The Fundamental Wrangler School. Doesn't work, though. Professor Piggy. That's combining the others. But prof I mean, what was the other one? Fundamental Doctor. I like that one, too. There's so many good ideas. Wow, I one shot that guy. The outdoor piggies. <laughs> Q through, slow, wait for the skew, and do nothing. Tread carefully. I'm down to dive. Viego is, I think, just ulted there for cosmetic effects. Like, he just felt like doing something, but he's actually 2 and 0 as a shutdown, so I can't complain. Like, he's doing better than 80% of the jungles we've seen thus far in the series, so get off your horse, piggy. Uh oh, there's four people here. Ain't that beautiful. That's a really cool trick there where you, like, Q and then you, like, E them <clears throat> and to, like, get him away from the turret. I'm gonna walk like this, he doesn't see me. He has TP and I don't. Patience! Pairs of ears! Peggy! Arf! Sorry. That's better. Press on. Press on, baby. Oh, I thought my jungler was doing well, but this guy's 26 higher, and has dragon, and has grubs. Nice! So my team is losing again. Nice! Nice! Bot lane, three plates down, mid lane, zero, two, jungle. And just let me carry again, guys! Yeah, he gets six grubs, so he gets two turn plates. His mom is fat, too. No! Okay, no, 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 come here, that, no, we don't do that here. Tauby, you do not whip me out of the cannon. I'm the only one that does that kind of stuff. Alright, uh, you got the cannon, I'm upset. I should have ulted. Well, I'll ult here. I should have ulted Ash. Viego ult for fun again. What a useless ult. Useless ult. Useless ult. Fine, mess. So how to win, chat? So how to win? I'm two levels on this guy. I have five kill participation out of seven. Uh, okay, mid got a solo bolo. I, I like to see that. That's very good to see. I'm just surprised to see my team actually get a kill or like do something without me. I'm legit getting a syndrome or I feel like I have to do everything. Hey, how you know? Look at my damage, baby.
Diana could look for me. Here for the music. All right, arrows. Based. <clears throat> the thing is my youngler is 3 and 0 but he's like 30 CS down and 6 grubs and 2 dragons so it's like yeah he is 3 and 0 he is fucking useless and the herald Diana has 5 on 0 for the neutrals. I don't want to be negative Nancy. You know what? I do want to be negative Nancy. I hate Chen. I hate him. I hate my teams. I love my life though. Get him. That's alright. That's what I anticipated. Look at that piggy. Fight me like a man. I got all my ultimate ulti stacks, by the way. Five out of five. We're chilling. That was the ult was very important, Viego. There, well done, Viego. See, I just had to, I just had to flay my team, and they started performing. I had to motivate them. Sometimes bullying can be the best. Okay, so never mind. He is TP. I gotta back off. Nice, very good. So I go. Now it makes sense. Now it makes sense. Get it? Why are you guys saying minus one? Because oh, all my teammates are dead again, I see why. Shen to help, he's lost it. <laughs> teams are f yeah, yeah. I don't wanna look. Look at this top laner again. 40 CS up, 8 kill participation. What else do you want from a top laner? Speaking teams, you, you remember on the Yorick climb, I, 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 I permanently had good teams. I have permanently shit teams on this account. Like, this account is cursed. I sound like Twitch chat. But this account is cursed, man! There is no My account is cursed! What are we doing? Why? <clears throat> Just before Dragon, just before... <clears throat> can we group like Dido? Yes, we can. If you are not brain dead. Br Brandad. If you are not Brandad. Bro, Drake is spawning. I'm ward clearing. We have no objectives. You have no shit, Viego. You've not been doing anything this game. I'm going to wipe your ass as well. We have no objective again! <laughs> what a surprise! Wait, why did he get out of the sleep? Was it the dragon? We have no objective again! Huh. What Elo is this? You don't want to know. Like you don't want to know. Don't tell him. I have, I have, I have eleven kill participation. This guy's all three of five. It's okay. It's okay.
It's okay. Shadow Knight, except I'm taking it for Prime. I'm taking it for Prime. You have a chance to carry this game. Phoenix Lord, you have about 55% chance to get Power Band. Choose your words carefully. How can we win? I'm gonna start accidentally betting Shannon like, Oh guys, I was sneaking a bit thin to just get some temporary Elon, get out of the shithole of this MMR. I don't wanna play here. Why did I leak my idea? It's a pretty good idea actually. I'm like 2k gold on this guy. That's futile. Because we're top lane. Oh well. My Ash is in side lane, first of all. That that is that part is pretty weird. Ah, oh, whatever. <clears throat> I've done everything I should do this game. I won lane, 60 CS up, got the full turret, ulted multiple times, gave all the kills as well. There's not much more I can do. No! No! Oh! <coughs> Why am I voice cracking permanently? So many piggies, you should start the farm? Bro, I'm gonna start, yes, not a farm where they're gonna live and like, have a happy life. I'm gonna start a butchering farm, bro. Yeah, he speaks out of my games. Ah, Sunfire, nice. They're gonna look for me. I have a feeling. He ran yeah, yeah, he randomly walked up. He randomly walked up. I saw like one thing and I knew what time it was. Wait for the W. Oh, never mind. There's like 50 million people here. Ah, the whole the whole the whole shebang. Because Alois is a shutdown for a, some random reason. And 21 minutes of the game, enemy team can just four people bot because my team is. Oh, they're gonna leash Nasher as well. Lovely. Oh well, yeah, well, let's see. Wait, with a head and kills. That's another banger. As that can save me from this one. As I would not save me from this one. I'm not gonna ult him. He can die alone. I need my wave. Ken are ready! <laughs> Sorry, that one just snapped my- that, that one just made me snap. Chai, I- I- I don't know. 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 Do I start playing Demolish Shen and I start split pushing? Like, do I actually just start playing Demolish Shen and I start split pushing? Is that the idea? Is that maybe the plan? Maybe just start playing. Okay, I'm gonna start playing split pushing Shen. I'm gonna go like Terminus split push Shen. Maybe that's just how we're gonna start carrying games Shen. All right, can somebody cook up a build? How do you play like Demolish Shen? Like Holebreaker, Terminus, Titanic Hydra. Titanic Hydra, Holebreaker, Terminus. With Demolish. Are we cooking chat? 
Is it rotten food or is it actually cooking? Split push them. And then we have ult to join the team. I can see it work. Crack and slay. Now that is spoiled food. Uh, let's get some more terminus practice in. Is there HP for the monster to be strong? Yeah, hole breaker and, and Titanic. 550? 350? Yeah, I'll have plenty of health. I'll scaling health and runes. Make it work. We'll play Split Push Shen. Okay, we'll try it. I can't, I can't win games like this. I gotta play Split Push Shen. Like, I, I can't win. I really can't. I'm dumb being a facilitator. I'm dumb being a babysitter for a 50 year old grown man that still need to get breastfed. I can't win. I can't win. Bork would kinda be nice in synergy with your passive, no? Yeah, sure, let's go Bork as well, why not? I already have percentage of damage in my Q, but let's go Bork as well. How can win, man? On Zawoy, they were the tier one! I started playing LOL a few months ago, and sir, you look a lot like a BSJ who is an education content creator, lol. BSJ? Remind me to watch this, to search this up after this disgusting game is passed. With the Halo Blade Nautilus. Looking for wards again. Great. Titanic, Holebreaker, Trinity Force, Sterox, Terminus. Okay, we're gonna try this. I'm gonna try Split Push next game. I'm done. I'm done with this shit. I'm gonna try Split Push Demolish all the way. Is this bronze? when Ari has like flesh old Zonia, she has <laughs> this Nautilus this Nautilus needs to get sent to a psych ward he's sending me into a psych ward if this guy is serious he needs like he needs to be uh, like he needs an autopsy what's going on in the guy's brain how do you miss four people standing next to each other and why don't you press yes when we can have F? Oh, so many questions. So many questions. So guys, how's the challenge going? Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Not pretty good. Yes. Let's press no! Let's press no! Winnable! Alright, chat, let's win this one now, yeah? Let's win this one now. Winnable. Let's group at Elder. I got Terminus Power Spike. I'm the Terminator now. Alright, never mind. Let's group up with this Nautilus. Let's get inside the mind of this Nautilus. Oh, we're getting butchered.
C grouped. <laughs> Support getting caught, two options. It could be, oh, I got caught, or we could just say they grouped and we didn't. Okay, smart. Okay, it's Hajj uh, chat. You know what? I want to stop the stream. I really, really do. But I can't. I can't, I can't go out on losses like this. I'm gonna try one game of Split Push Shen and see how it goes. I'm gonna try Split Push Shen. I'm not gonna play this champion conventionally anymore and look to facilitate my team when I'm trying to facilitate... I'm getting toxic. I'm getting toxic, man. I don't usually stream past six hours, but something, there is, there's something burning inside. And I am... Um... Not having the best experience. Vision score at 20 minutes from our sub 20. It's cause we didn't group. Hold on chat. Actually chat, I can't. No, my, my, my brain is numb. You know what? Tomorrow, I'll start the stream and I'll do split push shen. I'll do split push shen tomorrow for the stream. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't anymore today. It's been a battle. It's been it's been a gruesome battle. This has been my hardest challenge this far, by far. I'm hard stuck in platinum. But the thing is, like the losses we have, I am outperforming enemies of so ridiculously hard. Hey, what was this game? Like this guy's one and eight. One. This guy, like he, he fixed his score late game, but like can't win. This is the, this is what I have to do to win one game on Shen. One game, one game, right? Um. Yeah, no, this game we lost. Looked like a problem a year. You know, like three K two K gold tiff here. I deserve the win. This game I, I I play bad, by the way. I can admit that. And this game too. Oh, this is gonna take a long time, chat. This is gonna take a very long time. Right, chat. I have a few requests for you. Okay. There is a new series that I want to make on YouTube. I'm looking forward to feedback. So if you guys could bless me up, check out that video, that link I sent in chat right there. Check it out, five to ten minutes. If you like it, leave a comment down below. It would help me out a lot trying to figure out content into the future. I want to test up some more new series idea. Basically, I want to more want to make more dedicated YouTube content. So that's the first idea I have. As per usual, chat. Highly recommend you check out my two courses. Link is in chat. Aloysinnail.com. I have two courses. One is for the lighting phase. One is for the mid to late. Each of them have one free preview video. So you should check it out regardless. You will learn new stuff. If you like the layout and the setup, you can consider getting the full package. Check it out. Like I said, it's free. Why shouldn't you? You'll learn something new. I guarantee you. Other than that, thank you for being here. Thank you for the subs. Thank you for the follows. Thank you for um, witnessing my mental descent. Uh, regardless of the day, I had a blast. This challenge will just take a little bit longer than uh, than I might want. Such is life. We're gonna be raiding somebody. Dragdar. We're gonna raid Dragdar. Amazing call to creator. Thank you so much, man from White for the hundred. Dragdar is an Ezreal main US, probably the best Ezreal player we have. Go check him out. He does educational AD carry content too. I think he's an absolutely amazing persona. So. Give him some love, give him a heart from the Piggy Fundamentals crew. I wish you all an amazing evening, chat. Thank you for your blessings. Bless you all. See you tomorrow. Let's go.